gentlemen, I, it makes you appreciate how dead Galaxy Heroes is without the magic of Grass Arena! My, oh my. I know why you guys are excited. Let us break it down. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. In case you don't know where you are, you're here on an Aldera, the prime center hub of the Kyber Empire, hosted by yours truly, God's gift of mobile gaming, the eighth day of creation. The Upper Idol T101, the first is named the King of Triple B. And many other fancy titles, directed video games, yada, yada, yada. But we are here right now as one unified body because it's been a snooze fest in Galaxy is number one, but number two. We're getting off the hamster wheel that Capital Games wants us to be on. Oh, I gotta get my data across. Oh, I gotta use my Galactic Legends. No! Today, we play the game the way it's meant to be played. Fun! And if you don't know what that means, F is for friends who do stuff together. You! It's for you and me. M is for anywhere and anytime at all. Throw your data across in the deep blue. I think the point's been made. <sighs> Calm down, everyone. I just want to see where we get going. Woo. It feels so good to be back with you guys live streaming. Because there's like nothing to do in Galaxy Heroes, the off week going into the off season of Grand Arena. And we're just going to make sure I know 33 is not your cup of tea. It's not your pill you like to take in the morning. But what better way to start off the season with you amazing group of folks by doing a Grand Arena Sandbox Challenge. It's been a minute, and it, again, too many people, they're stuck on the hamster wheel. They gotta do the Datacrons, they gotta use the Galactic Legends. They, they're in try hard mode. They're being good pets for CG, but you take them off the wheel, and they're like, holy cow, this is fun. And uh, we got some fun on the free-to-play account as well. Let me just quickly, oh man. <sighs> I'm so excited, man. I, 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 there's something weird going on at the free-to-play account. I've seen other people kind of re say the same thing. Matchmaking seems normal all of a sudden. I, I, I we'll talk about that. Then we have the main account, dark side, odd, attack versus light side only defense. No galactic legends, no data crowns. So we got plenty of stuff cooking in the kitchen for you guys. Holy cow. Let me make sure I catch it before we get too far behind her. We have ourselves Rossi starting us off with the one gifted membership. Thank you. Means a lot, my friend. What else do we have here? We have Swinny085, months of the Cyber Club VIP Plus program. Let's dominate the GIC, baby! And thank you for your five months in the Kyber Club VIP Plus program. Love seeing you, Swinny. We have Rossi again. Holy cow, man. Rossi already throwing the dollars, the dollar bills before we even get started here. $10 super jet from Rossi again. A GA. I'm on the way to Florida from Georgia in the car. It's a spur of the moment trip. It's my aunt's 70th birthday. My oh my. And I'm going to MegaCon. Woo, I have four hours left. You have to stream till I'm done. Hey, don't worry. I'll be around for a, a, a portion of that. So make sure you put me on. Yeah, if you think about it, you, you just, I'm putting you through like hyper speed right now. Think about it. By the time I'm done, you'll be like, holy cow. I've, I've got. He did a whole entire global travel. I, I, I can't explain it. It just works that way. Then we have Michael Pruitt, 34 months. I'm in a car too, but I'm driving funny empire. <laughs> Salute to you, Michael. Thanks as always for your service and being around here. Even though you're driving 25, eight for one extra, one extra day of putting the miles on hard, baby. Then we have music, Rutgeber with the $2. Gary, start the freaking street. Literally the guy, it's been a week here. He forgot how to press the start button. Don't, don't, don't get me started. On that there oh gosh and then we have joe 26 48 one month joining the empire after watching ever since 2017 my oh my 2017 probably my favorite for galaxy is thrawn commander luke hot territory battles oh my oh my oh my what a good year for galaxy of heroes right there and then we have uh, joe 26 48 with the one month joining the empire after watching ever since 2017 I read that wrong. That was the last guy. RGG, all right, let's try that again. $2, 33 is hard. But what have we? The master of beating it. <laughs> That's me. I'm, I'm, always, I'm always beating this hard, baby. You know how it goes. 
don't you dare take that out of context either. And then we'll do one more before I get you uh, pumped up here. I mean, I don't know which one I want to do first. I think we should rip off the free-to-play Grand Arena first, just because I want to make sure we knock out a few things here. Uh, then what else do we have here? Oh, hold on, one more. Oh, then we have uh, Tyrannic, five pounds. Hey, Otto, can you use the Knights or Acolytes today? Please, she's my favorite. I think she's one of the few. I, did I gear up? I don't know if I've ever geared up Knights of Death. Cause there's like six characters I've never geared up. I, I, I'm not sure she's one of them. I know Karth is one of them. I know T Bone, a couple. Of, I'll double check. Maybe I could squeeze her in since we're doing some dark side only offensive stuff here. And then one, one more. Guardsman Dale, three months. Gotta love being a part of the Kyber Empire. Thank you. Appreciate your three months in the Kyber Cobalt League program. That, one, one more because I'm still gonna be behind. I had a dream last night, says Yacht at the five dollars, that the road ahead was about to roll out of the first gear or first gear of gear 14. I've never felt so relieved to wake up. LTK. I had a Galaxy Heroes related dream yesterday before we get into it. Uh I had it was so random. I had a dream. I, and I actually had to double check just to make sure it wasn't a dream. I was like, is this is this a dream or not? Because that would be pretty awesome. I had a dream that Cubs Fan Han was making Galaxy Heroes videos. Like it felt so real in my mind. And then I woke up and said, like, is he back on YouTube? And Alas, he was not, unfortunately. But uh, I, we both had Galaxy Heroes related dreams. It's a bit sad if you think about that. Galaxy Heroes is infiltrating our dreams. But <laughs> anyways, that's a, that's a, that's a, that he said, she said, Gary, just put me on the screen. There we go. All right. And, you know, I, I can't tell you how many Galaxy Heroes dreams I've had. It's a, it's actually uh, quite uh, quite shocking. Yeah, it's a plot orcs by CG. <laughs> I've had, I mean, I'm trying to recall some of my other Galaxy Heroes dreams. They're, they're, they're pretty wild. I'm sh I, listen, don't act like you're different. I know you guys have had dreams where like your roster got wiped out or you unlocked a character or some character came. Listen, we're, we're, we're messed up. It sounds like a Chris Nolan dream. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. We have too much goodies on the board. Oh, free to play count. Our first Kyber experience. And it's like the, it's actually one of the most competitive matches I've seen. In months, normally we're like out GL by like six GLs and they have like 20 million GP more. Oh, what do we do first, man? Ah, oh. I'm going to do the free to play count first. So we can, uh, yeah, let's do this one first. Let me just show you what's going on. Now I had some people comment on my video yesterday. I'm like, that's weird because I'm feeling it too. So, you know, doesn't mean it's happening. Correlation does not mean causation. Maybe it's just, uh, just a, a spur of the moment. Maybe it's like a once in a blue moon thing, but check this out. So Kyber 4. Had to battle our way through a Rhodium. And for some reason, our opponent here feels more like someone that I should have been matching in a Rhodium, not in Kyber. So anyways, let's give a round of applause for our first Kyber 4 opponent. Food and Steel! Representing the Wookiees and Cream. So check this out. Shh, 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 shh. Can you not see it, Gary? Well, they, they can't see. Well, how, how am I supposed to see if they can't see? All right, so uh, let's do this first so you can see. Okay. Look at that GP. First off, 6.9 <laughs> million GP. Now, I might be like, Arnold, that's still outmatched. You're still outmatched. That's fine. I mean, it's okay. And not every roster has to be exactly 5 million with me. But, like, most of my opponents have been, like, 9, 10 million GP. We're even on the GL front. We both have three Galactic Legends. I mean, yes, they'll have a little bit more, like they have Malgus, but it's not like that. It's more, but it's not that much more. Okay, you know what I'm trying to say. For for me, this is actually like semi-competitive. Ship-wise, let's see what we got over here. I didn't check their capital ship. Um, we have a small advantage on the capital ship front. It looks like we have one bigger capital ship than they have and not really much going on in the dc departments here but like this is pretty darn close now check this out this is like one of the closest fights i've had i can't remember the last time i had like a fairly manageable matchup here so new to our free-to-play grand arena we have mr j and i took a look at my opponent's defense and i'm like holy cow i can actually maybe go a little heavy on defense because normally i gotta go full on offense we're fighting 9 10 11 million gp accounts like i can't put stuff on defense but i'm like wait we can actually do something so based off their roster i kind of assumed and you know they might not be done they might be still doing some work i assumed our brand new jabba with the ultimate would be a bit of a struggle i was uh the only worry i was like they could use supreme leader kyle red on offense and that could get through it. But as we're going to see, they put SLKR down. So I don't know. Maybe I got to take a closer look 
I don't know how they're going to beat that. I don't think they can one-shot it. I think they still have Sith Eternal, but Sith Eternal's not a great counter for Jabba. They can maybe two-shot it, potentially. So we'll have to wait and see. So this is like the first... I haven't put a GL on defense in so long because I just feel like I'm outclassed every single time, out-rostered. But it's like, all right. And we put Sith Eternal down on defense. <sighs> And then let's take a look at the other stuff. Not really much else going, but we need more characters on defense. I need more ships now. Let's go show you the ships. So again, I don't know if they're like tapped out or they're going to come back later. They oddly left the most difficult stuff. The Executor, not even touched yet. Jabba, not even touched yet. And here's how I'm doing my three ship defense. Now I'm throwing the, my, it's pretty garbage. My garbage negotiator and a Separatist Tarkin lineup. So we'll see. Normally, my opponents just like one shot everything with their massive roster, but I think I actually have a chance of stopping my opponent on defense. Take a look at their defense. Here's what we got going. We have ourselves a Bastila. Have ourselves just like Maul leftovers. Again, I haven't seen a defense like this in a minute, man. We have Malgus, which we're going to figure out. We have a Jedi Master Luke, and we got Padme. So pretty, again, manageable stuff that we got going on here. And then let's go take a look at the top side. And here was their one ticket to get through my job. I think they gave it up. They put Supreme Little Kylo Ren on the defense. So I was like, ooh, that's good for me. And everything else is pretty standard. So again, as we we're kind of seeing, I mean, I don't know what this lineup is. That's, that's a little wacky, but it's like, we can actually have a bit of fun in this one. We can put some stuff on defense, make them bleed a little bit. <sighs> let's get to business, folks. Let's get to business. And see what we can do in our first Kyber experience. I should probably, you know what? Let's move. After we're done at the Grand Arenas, I'm going to go take a look at my opponents and see if the other matches are like this. Because this feels like, why does this feel more Erodia me than Kyber? I have no idea. All right. Easy win for you. Well, hold on. You know, let's, let's not get too cocky. I, I like that you guys are cocky. But when I say we can be cocky, we can be cocky. Let's make sure we start getting some plays out there. Because you, you know, 3v3, you feel good. And then all of a sudden, you're not feeling so good. So speaking of feeling good, let's go after this Jedi Master Luke thing here first. And then we have uh, Yotter, two dollars. I put one of my friends in your playlist. Peep the DMs. Let, we'll check it out later, Yotter. We got to get plays going. We have two Grand Arenas. I got two hours. I might need to remind myself later on, but I'm going to try my best to keep my brain fully functional so we can check out those messages a bit later. But thanks for the heads up, Yotter. So first battle. I don't have Sith Eternal on me. So I think for this first one, we can go one of two routes. Maybe three. Now what do we have here? All right. Uh, okay. Nothing too crazy. I'm thinking what we do for this first one is probably let's do our trade counter. Now the question I'm wondering is, do I want to bring in Darth Vader or do I want to bring in Darth Nihilus? And then five v five, Darth Vader is so nice to have. And three v three, you only get have three cooks rather than five inside the kitchen. Oh yeah, there's no ultimate on the Jedi Master Luke. Oh, that's even better for us. So I mean, I mean, really, it's the ultimate's not that important for luke it's just that all that protection damage he's doing so yeah master luke without ultimate's not like you know jabba or you know lord vader where they kind of need the ultimate he's one of those it's nice but you don't like necessarily need it star killer yeah i was thinking star killer could be good i don't know if i want to go down this route but we also can maybe just do some perimeter kyle ren maybe do Wat tambor that might be okay i don't know how much money i want to put on that so we kind of have a few options here but i would ideally like to save some perimeter kyle ren for the Malgus, but actually, they didn't have Malik on there, right? There's no Malik. Star Killer should be easy money there. So why does Javanese Thal? He doesn't need it, but it's. I've noticed in the Kenobi matchups, the ultimate. It's. It's a. It's a freaking insta kill with massive benefits to it. It's. Jabba's. He's the thermal detonator. Like, I don't need. It's a freaking insta kill. It's like telling me Darth Nihilus does need insta kill. It feels better. Is all I'm saying. You know what? Screw it. I'm just getting into this battle. Let's just, just, just I'm not even going to think about it. Just, you know, freaking A. Let's get in there. First play of the 3v3 Grand Arena. Let's just go and hope this goes A-OK. -okay. I, I think Vader's good. It, it, Vader just feels better, though, right? Sure, Vader feels right. better. It just feels better. Vader, I just like, I feel like, where's my damage? No, I feel like we might get stuck behind Jedi Master Luke. Unless Savage and Treya can keep up. Just screw this in there. Just get it. Just get it. Just get it. Let's get, let's get, let's get, just get it in there, crank it! Oh, oh god! My eardrum! Perfect! Alright, let's get in there, come on. Alright, we gotta get some turns. Cool down and create! Alright, let's get that ice light popping, insta-kill. Working its way downtown.
All right, let's just keep doing basics. We're going to try to save this the kill for that Luke Skywalker there. All right, stay strong, stay strong, stay strong. Ah, Dave, that kind of sucked. It's fine, it's fine. Keep doing basics. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right, give us some ability block. All right, got a ability block locked in. I'm still worried about the damage, though. We'll get through when we get there. All right, I, no, nothing about this, spell. Stay strong. No, 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 I don't like that. Don't like that. Gotta get some eyes taunting. Ooh, don't like that at all. All right, come on, some eyes. Gotta get taunting, buddy. Ooh, he's not taunting. He's not taunting. What are you... Savage, what in the bloody hell are you doing, man? You're supposed to taunt. What are you doing? You're just sitting there. You need to taunt. And this is what I'm saying. It's not over till we get in there. Oh, well. Well, let's see how this goes. Drop off the pump immunity. Oh, my God, dude. Drop it off. Thank you. No, over here. Oh, my God. Savage. You gotta do something, man. Thank you. No, all right, we got that. Okay. Okay, here we go. Can we kill Herma Yoda? All right, Herma Yoda's gone. Jeez, buddy, come on. Oh, no, 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 Ugh. Drop him down. Okay. No. Oh. No, no. Come on. I need to get around the taunt. I need to get around. I need to get around. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Ugh. We're so close. We're so close. No, 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 no. Keep going here. Okay. Come on. I need to get around this. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no. God, no. Oh, God, no. There we go. Keep going here. There we go. All right. Nyla. We got... Oh, it's open. No. Here we go. All right. All right. I got what I needed. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. We got it. We got it. I don't know if we're going to get the clear, but I'll take that. The Jedi Master Luke by himself should be fairly manageable. I don't know. Maybe they'll figure it out. I doubt it. Nas does not have the damage on him. I don't know. Maybe Darth Vader would have been a bit better here. Darth Vader ability blocks and get around the taunt a little bit easier. I'm not sure if Nihilus was... In 3v3, it doesn't feel as good. It's fine. We got what we needed, though. Ooh. Yeah. Gosh, thanks. Well, for the 3v3, where things get a little bit nuttier than usual. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get through the... Yeah, without Treyas, ability block, healing immunity, isolate. We won't get through it, but that's fine. Easy cleanup. And again, I just don't know if we need the full clear. I don't know if Jabba's going to hold the wall for me. Let's we'll wait and see. Rebel Fires, I don't have them. Don't got them. Don't got him. But soon we're working on Mon Mothma and all that stuff for the Jedi Mask Luke requirements. Speak of the devil. So uh, we will have that sooner rather than later. All right. What do we have here? While we wait, let, let Master Luke do his thing. <laughs> Red Boba. Thank you so much for the new membership to the Comic Club VIP Plus Program. Bo is confirmed for February 10, 2024. It says Fiddy. With the two Canadian Bakeroonies. Did CG said that? Is it in game? Is it in game? Where while we wait for these guys to sort out that. Uh, I don't data mine? Maybe in the data mines? Is Bo, Bo Katan coming again? That'd be pretty wild. Uh, something fishy, fishy, fishy is going on with that. Data mines. Uh, I don't see anything. Data mine? That's the event post. Uh, post. Galactic challenges. I'm not seeing. Uh, it looks like I read everything here. Yeah, general data mine. I don't see that. Store. Unless maybe they just did it post and they just this maybe set it somewhere i don't see it in the data mine event post event post event post event post events post i don't see it forum post forum post check sbh news summary my god how many freaking sub channels these people need, man? I can't find nothing on here. 
Uh, Alright, we'll talk about it later. I'm not gonna spend five million years trying to find this uh, territory war sign up. I don't see it. I don't see it. It's at the top. Seven events. I see territory war sign up, grand arena, territory, grand arena, territory war. Uh, event details? No, that's not what I want. I don't know. We'll check it out later. It sounds pretty wild, though. We'll uh, check it out later. Even, uh, listen, estimate the, the official forum. Oh, the official forum. I thought we were talking about the, the, the Discord server. All right, hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Bo Katan, Chase Bundle. No. All right. We got Grand Arena to play. We'll, we'll check it out later. If so, it's, it's weird. It's weird, but we'll talk about it later. It's not like I need to drop everything right now and look for it. All right. I would be, I wouldn't be too surprised, but I'd be mildly surprised. Like I, I'm, like it's like there, I, there was already something weird going on both that, that they brought her back two weeks later, and now they're bringing her back another two weeks later. Uh, it's, it's weird. Anyways, it's in the Discord. It, don't say it's in the Discord. Do you know? I literally, I, I was on a call. Mobile gamers like, dude, your Discord's a mess. I have like twenty thousand unread notifications. I don't sit and like eat my crackers and cheese while on their Discord server. I'll, I'll look for. Oh, hold on, event notifications. Gosh, I haven't looked at this. There's like, okay, just go. What the hell is this? What the hell? All right. Uh, is this like 100% confirmed? Like, I mean, I, 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 again, I know that data mines are mostly confirmed. I can't say it's 100% confirmed. You know, subject to change, TBD, all those fun little things there. Uh, Freaking February 10th, what are they doing? Is this like, I mean, I'm not complaining. It's, I, we want it to be frequent, right? Maybe they're trying out something new, but where the heck is Cal Castillas? <laughs> That's right, Gary, you hit up the air horn. Uh, I mean, again, I'm, I'm, I'm happy that the event's repeating. It's, it's good to have frequency, to, I mean, at least in my opinion. I know people say, no, it's not good to have frequency. Um, interesting, interesting. Uh, why does it matter anyways? Uh, well, because otherwise most of our events are like Cal where <laughs> he's been gone for like, what, four or five months? When is he coming back? I don't know. Uh, it's good. I, I, I like that they're bringing consistency. I just, is that gonna, uh, I don't know. It, it, it's, it's not like a, a, a big, big deal, but it's like, it'd be a big deal if they keep doing this. Like, but why are they doing this with her and not Cal? I don't know. Anyways, moving on here. We have Darth Malgus. I don't really want to goof around on this. Uh, I mean, um, how confident are you feeling in Star Killer? Because the man, the longer I can hold on to SLKR, the better I'll be. I think we can also use Star Killer, though. We can use Star Killer on the Supreme Leader Kylo Ren, I think, uh, on the top that they have because they have no Hawks. Terminator should be looking pretty gooch, and we can go with it. Yeah, I don't know. You're back on. Welcome back, Michael. Great seeing you. Uh, I, I think I'm just going to go with this. Let's just play it safe. Uh, you know what? I could probably just do this. Since I don't have Sith Eternal on deck, we could probably just basically, you know, do something like this. I don't know if I really need a tank, though. Do we need a tank? What tanks do we have at our disposal? Might as well use something. Something. Yeah, you know what? Just, I don't know. Get me... You know what? Give me that Kyle Ren mask. Let's go for it. Yeah, Becca's even farmable yet. I thought it was going to be farmable this week. Ugh. There was no update at all. Solo SLKR. Yeah, let's just, I'll do this. This feels better. I have no use for Watt Tambor. Again, let's get through. Let's not drop too many more. The Master Luke battle, I was a little iffy about anyway, so I'm not too surprised by that. Anyways, so no, no, let's keep moving along here. Yeah, we got, uh, we got too many plays. Short amount of time. So let's just keep us moving along here. This should be nice and easy. We could throw Star Killer here, Star Killer there. Let's just do it here. I'm feeling good about this. All right. Let's go ahead and pass this on over to my boy. Let's go. Do the buff this spell. Ba -ba -ba -bow. All right. And goodbye. What? He did his job. Okay. Let's go ahead. Do a little siphon siphon. Yeah. Yeah. A little swipey swipey action there. There we go. Let's see if we can pop this over on Bastla. Nice it. Nice it. Nice it. All right. Pain is temporary. What? Tambor's forever. There we go. We got it out. We got it out. We're looking good. Okay. I really don't think we need the data crown, or not the data crown, the Watt Tambor, but what else am I gonna use it for? He's not really doing much without my Sith Eternal on deck. All right, good stuff, good stuff. All right, let him do his thing. I feel like we are pretty safe at this point. Just do a couple more swipes. We'll be taking it to the bank. Just do another, there we go. That's fine, take your time, buddy. We got this, we got this. All right, get that off. Keep doing your thing. Nice buff immunity. Let's pop it again. Might go into ultimate just to make sure we save on my banners. Let's go for it. All right. Keep moving. 
Oh, come on. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Put him down. Put him down. Strike him with all your anger. Thank you. All right. He gone. He gone. He gone. Taking the video vibe. Let's keep moving along. So um, we'll have to come back on that master look in a bit. All right. Padme with Commander Ahsoka Tano. Hmm. All right. Couple of ways I can cut this up. Since there is no Kenobi, we might, mm, keyword might, be able to just bounty hunter this. The only thing I don't like is... Let's check the speeds real quick. Hold on. Check it out. Troopers might work. Yeah, but I think there was a, I think there was a Darth Revan on top somewhere. Yeah, let me find it real quick. Troopers versus Darth Revan would be very much so. Yeah, there's a Darth Revan here. So likely, I would like to save Imperial Troopers for that battle. So that's why I, I'm, I'm trying to see if we can opt to not use that. We got to use Bounty Hunter somewhere. It's just a question of do I feel Gucci <sighs> about uh, Bounty Hunters here. All right, bounty hunters. Let me check it one more time before we fully commit to this opportunity here. Uh, we can target anybody, basically. The only downside is if Bosk's taunt comes off. I mean, Bosk should be taunting for a minute, right? We, we just got to check the speeds. If Bosk taunts, he shouldn't drop his taunt. There's no confusion. There's no buff immunity on this team to stop me. And remember, Bosk, unique ability, trained ocean rage. Uh, when boss loses taunt, he gains taunt for one turn if the weakest enemy has protection. And they're going to have protection for a minute. So I think we can hold it off. We just got to make sure we nuke out Commander Tano. I feel like this is going to be the way to go. Ahsoka basically, but remember, no, 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 no. Remember, they have a buff this spell, but the taunt will reappear so long as the weakest enemy still has protection on him. And with all of our attacking out of turn, I think we'll be okay. So I think it's the kill cat. It's the kill Padme. Take it to the bank. Take it to the bank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Malik Solo, he's on defense. Kind of did a nasty Sith Eternal team. First time thrown. I think that's the first I put Sith Eternal on defense. Now that I think about it, I'm going to go with this because, again, we have a lot more teams in Erodium. I need to do bounty hunters in some sort of high capacity format. And this feels like it's going to be pretty good. All right. Race to the Insta Kill, baby. You know how it goes. Let's go ahead. Send a big shot against the crew. Let's get to work. All right, boss taunt. We hit, it looks like I didn't check Padme's speed, but I'm assuming we're gonna be a bit faster, right? Yes, all right, we're a little bit faster. All right, let's get to work. All right, let's go ahead and target Ahsoka. Yes, like they're gonna have protection for a minute here. And we should be able to keep our taunt out. Beautiful, see, there we go. Taunt reappearing, as I said, I was looking for Anakin like buff immunity, C-3PO confusion. It would be a little bit different of a story. Now, the thing is we have to work fast because that Tano, she's not playing around. She's working towards that. Oh, maybe Fennec would have been better. Ooh. Oh, I wonder if Fennec would have been the better choice. Oh, well, shoulda, coulda, woulda. Keep going. All right. Ooh, I needed that hit. All right. Let's uh, ooh, reverse card this. Hit him back. All right. We got to work fast. Come on. Get to the, we need that insta kill. All right. Oh, I feel like we could have been at that contract by now. All right. There we go. All right. We need to get us moving along here. It looks like we should be able to get before Commander Town. I'm feeling okay. All right. Do that. All right. Oof. Boy, that boss is not looking great. All right, but we are going to be able to nuke up Commander Tato. Let's go ahead and line up the shot. First since the kill of the 3v3 season of 2024. Send that Commando Tano out the door. All right, boss, we got to fix you up, dude. There we go. Perfect timing. Boss is ready to do a scream. I feel it. You know, sometimes you just got to let a good boss Trandoshan scream. Here we go. There we go. That's what we needed. And we're topped off. Okay, let's just keep focusing on Tano for right now. We're gonna do next insta kill on Padme. Keep killing us up. We're looking fine. You know what? Throw, you know what? Let's get the crit. Let's get the crit. Just do this right now. Keep killing the team. There we go. Uh, stun, mild concern. Barely an inconvenience, though. All right, do another basic. Got some turn meter. Look at fine. Look at fine. All right, we gotta try to get some of this off here. Ooh, we're fine. We're fine. Just do a basic. Okay, taunt up. All right. Oh, we gotta watch out for that. Uh, do that. Looking good. Just got to keep moving us along. Mando, how much longer for to kill? One more turn. I can wait that long. We're good. We are good. Let's keep healing up. Good griefs. Days on the base. If you try to heal me up a little bit here. All right. And then once we get out, Padme, we are good to go. So look at Boss was taunting literally the whole entire game. Get yeeted. Reading is important. It's a very important skill. The hell. Think about it. if we would have forgotten about that taunt thing game over we are cooking y'all yeah we got it we're good all right Whew. come on let's wrap it up wrap it up come on there's, just come on there's no more padme let's max banners like 
that's probably the best use I'm going to get on my bounty hunters in 3v3. Like, that was great. 57 max banners. Kind of a scary team if you don't have the right tool. All right. So far, so good. So far, so good. Okay, let's keep moving things along here. We got a Basla. We have a Darth Maul. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. A boss kit was my thesis in Sogology degree. There we go. Yadar, I know you, uh, you're very intelligent when it comes to boss kit. Like, you are literally the boss professional. So if someone ever needed an expert, like, if you ever get that Rick guy from Pawn Stars, he's like, uh, let me call my boss expert. He knows everything about the Trandoshans. He's going to call you up, man. Just think about it. Anyways, point aside, this isn't a particularly deadly team. It's, a, it's, it's kind of a, a little tanky. What's, 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 our, what's our options here? Okay, Darth Revan. Um, I have no Malik at my disposal. Um, I don't know if I feel bueno about this here. I mean, maybe it'll be okay, but I feel like it's gonna take me. I need. I feel like I need. I need someone to back me up here. Wampa. Okay. Yeah. I don't think it would take too long, right? Yeah, Wampa feels good. The question is, do I need Wampa for something else, though? Let's see. Uh, we don't need Wampa for that. Uh, oh, how, we we got to pause for a How am I cleaning up Jedi Master Luke Skywalker? That's something to worry about. All right, I'm not seeing too many Wampa opportunities, except maybe that Rolo down there. Hmm. We might need to send in something kind of expensive to clean up Master Luke. I don't I mean, maybe Imperial Troopers and just don't have to worry about the full clear. Is my opponent full clearing hard to say? All right. Dr. Revan, yeah, I would like the. I think maybe Bob, but maybe Boba Fett can handle the. Yeah, maybe Boba Fett can handle. We'll, we'll get there when we get there. All right, let's do Wampa. I like it. Let's do it. Wampa, Wampa, baby. We got to get the, our Wampa action going. So if you don't mind, please put your hands together for the first Wampa 3v3 for you and me of 2024. Let's send this Wampa out the door. Let's go for it. Let's keep moving. We got a lot of Grand Arena to handle. Oh, we got a lot. We got a lot. I want to try to be done with this Grand Arena in 20 minutes. All right, here we go. Crank it up, crank it up, crank it up. All right, let's get to work. Send it. All right, put it on auto. We're going to need as much time as possible. This could take a minute, but we've handled bigger threats. Come on. There we go. We're getting there. Let, her, let the Wampa do its work, baby. Yeah, we're getting there. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. 7,000, 46,000. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Keep ramping up those rookie numbers. 52,000. There we go. Protection. Back up. There we go. 53,000. Almost down for the count. Joey could be a little annoying. Ah, I got the cleanse out. That's fine. All right. Joey. Joey. All right. Come on. Get him down. Get him down. Get him down. No, 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 no. Just do basic. There we go. Come on. Get him down. There it is. Full banners. Nice. Okay. All right. Down, you party animals! We got Darth Maul here on the line. Uh, am I? I was gonna say, am I crazy for thinking I can Geonosian this? I feel good if I can use Geonosians. Geonosians have to work, right? I know there's some like mild issues with my gear and all that, but I feel I feel pretty good about this. I feel like this would be good. Let's keep it going. Let's just keep it going. I, I feel. We got, yeah, let's go for that. I mean, some AOEs, mild complications. This is going to kill them. That's why I'm going to... I mean, we got to get down. Uh, let's just go for it. I have no use for them. Again, I need every team possible with the expanded defenses in Kyber. So let's see what we can do here. All right. Okay. Eight up the first two hits. Okay, we got to start healing up. Though. We got to start healing up a little bit. Okay. All right. Okay, let's heal up. Get back on top of things. All right, I don't like this. I, again, this is, I'm not like super confident about this, but let's see what I can do with it. All right, we can maybe get ourselves. Hmm, let's go do this. Okay. Can I get? Oh, not quite, not quite, not quite though. All right, Talon's out in the open. Come on, got ability block. We'll take it. Nice buff to spell. Almost there, almost there. Let's go back on Sid. All right. He should be coming back out. All right, oh, Talon, let's go. Back on Talon. All right. We got to watch. I, I'm worried about the next round of AoEs that are going to come our way. Come on, let's get Talon out. Do we have a heal ready? Do I have a heal? Not yet. One more turn. One more turn. Oof, I'm getting a little concerned here. I don't like hitting Maul. It's going to give him turn meter. Oh, he got us. All right. Huh? 
my gear wasn't quite there. It was worth the risk. It's worth the risk. All right, now we, we're going to probably set something a little bit more serious here. Why don't we... Let's see, we could probably do like Boba Fett. Yeah, maybe Boba Fett would probably be a better answer here. Maybe save her. Um, yeah. Um, I would like to save Aura. We could maybe do Aura Fennec something. All right, Nessel, I'm going to go with this. Please, Boba Fett. I know they're preloaded. I know I should have backed up. It's fine. You got this. You got this. Just survive. Just survive for a little bit. The AoE's already kind of burnt out. Uh, okay, I lied. I'm sorry. Listen, don't get mad at me. I thought it was burnt out. Oh boy, barely took on. I'm kind of worried about this here. Hmm. All right, let's try and throw this out. Maybe I should. Oh, I should have probably done the other ability. Okay, come on, get get Sidious out here. Come on, give me some ability block. Here we go. Yeah, do some of this. Do some of that. That might help out. Uh, a little bit. Are right, we got it? Just give me that Sidious. Come on. There we go. All right, that's good. That's good. All right. All right, boy. Sidious is feeling extra thick right now. Come on. Almost down. Almost down. Yeah, we got to hit him. That's fine. All right, we got it. We got it. Didn't get my protection. They still didn't get my protection. All right, that's fine. Okay, we got through it. I was taking a bit of a gamble because I was hoping I could... I was hoping I could do bounty hunters here. Uh, so that's why I went for a little bit of a risk with the Genosian. So let me see. Oh, I don't want to use, like, Imperial Troopers or anything like that here. Oh. I want to save Hermit Yoda. We can... Is this going to be enough? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Is this going to be enough? What do we feel? Best guard Mando. Um, I just don't know if that's enough damage. I mean, we could try. And then maybe here we could maybe keep the armor in there. Me, I, I feel like if I can get the three stacks on Fennec, that should be good. All right. We have Ida, but she's only gear 12. I'm not great. Let's 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 try this out. Again, I would like to not use Imperial Troopers. We kind of need them for some other high shelf items. All right. Okay. We're getting a couple plays out there. Let's see if we can try to get that three stacks of Beskar over. That's fine. Let's start buttering them up a little bit. All right. We got what we needed. Let's, there we go. Let's get Fennec up and running. Start giving me some counters. Nice. Just got to watch out. Let's see if we get another round of Beskar pop in here. Cooldown's jacked up, unfortunately. Keep doing our thing. Uh, let's see. Mm, boy, he's he really going hard on the bando right now. Come on, hit him back. Uh, all right, we need to do damage immunity. Looks like I'm not going to get that third stack of Beskar. I'm not feeling too hot about this. I'm going to try to believe a little bit longer. I wanted to get that third stack. All right. I mean, wow, he's going really hard on Beskar Mando for three. Is there, is there some sort of priority I don't know about? Hmm, very odd. I mean, we're gonna take this. Okay. Let's keep going. All right, looks like we lost our armor. Keep us moving. Uh, the thing is, that at some point, you know, armor shreds don't do much. Hmm. There we go. Healing with these nice, though. Come on. In the yellow? Not quite. Hit him back. Come on. Hit him back. Come on. Uh, I think we're going to have to throw Imperial Troopers at this. Yeah, we can't counter on that basic there. And we got Daze in us now. Yeah, I think we're going to probably... We might need to throw Imperial Troopers at it. You need more Armor Shreds? At some point, Armor Shreds is just... It's massive diminishing returns. Some People have a very big misunderstanding of how Armor Shred works. It's like if you take 10% of a 10% of a 10% of a 10%, you know, the the, the the gains aren't really that meaningful. There's massive diminishing returns. Even so, I didn't have many opportunities to get extra armor shreds. All right, I think just for the sake of time, I might need to throw Imperial Troopers at this. Um, unless you want to try something with Darth Vader. But again, I just don't want to, I don't want to F around with this anymore. We, we're going to need more teams. I think we should just throw Imperial Troopers call it a day. Yeah. Yeah, basically right there, what uh, Taserface says. Yeah, it's just like, it's, uh, at some point, it just gets really minute in terms of, like, if you had 100 armor shreds, it doesn't work the way you think it would. Uh, anyways, let's... Yeah, I'm just gonna throw this. I, you know, it sucks. It sucks. Um, I could do maybe Commander Luke here. All right, let's just go with it. Let's just go. Is he getting holds on defense? No, he didn't, but I'm assuming he had the U. He probably did a C mirror match, if I had to guess. All right. Let's get to, uh, let's get to work. Let's get to work. Uh, it depends. I'll have to see the 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 the, the, the record. 
If 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 Sith Eternal, if they had to pull a Sith Eternal, that's a win for me. I'm not mad about that. Alright, let's get to work. Do some of this. Give me some ability blocks. Nope. Or not. Totally fine. Not like I definitely didn't want that ability block. Okay. Alright, keep me moving. Keep me moving. There we go. In the yellow. Well, you might. Come on, give me some more juicy turn meter. And that's exactly why I wanted ability block. It's fine. We got it. We got it. One more hit. Come on, one more. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Oh! I don't know. I was hoping to save Imperial Troopers, but I had a feeling we were going to have to use Imperial Troopers. Alright. Back wall. Okay. Uh, let's make sure we get this back wall locked in. We have ourselves a mall, so we're probably... I, I, I might have to just run up the assumption they're not going to full clear. Because I, 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 think, I think I'm starting to run out of teams here. So what I'm thinking is... Uh, see, we could have maybe used Imperial... Nah. What do we want to use here? Can we maybe... How fast is this team? All right. I'm guessing not fast. 263. Okay. Do we want to use Jedi Knight Luke here? Do we want to use... I would like to not You have to use Star Killer right now. We can maybe go with... Um, probably could maybe do like a Han Chewie combo, maybe. Han Chewie combo, what are we feeling here? Dash Nest, you know, I don't have I don't have those options at my disposal. Don't have Nest yet. I have, I think she's almost at seven stars. I've been passively farming her through that stupid challenge or whatever. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I think we can either probably do Han Chewie and a Scoundrel of some sort, but I don't have many Scoundrels left over. We can maybe go like something like this. Uh, do I have like, I don't think I have Dark Sidious on hand. No, I don't have Dark Sidious on hand. This could be okay, but this also could be a problem <laughs> at the same time. Can Iden beat this again? I don't have the appropriate gear levels to maybe make this work. I mean, we could try. We can maybe try. It's just, uh, this doesn't feel great. I don't know. You know, let's give it a stab. Just give it a stab. Why not? Let's let's try to flex our item a little bit. I will have our gear 13 next time. I just took her to gear 13 last night. All right, um, I don't know about this. I feel like I want to do this. Yeah, you know, what? I'm just going to pop this up for now. All right, let's, uh, oh, I don't want Maul counter to S. Yeah, I don't want Maul counter to S. Screw it, just do it. Let's go for it. Yeah, this is exactly why I was doing. Okay, send it home. Come on. Give me a stun. Nope, no stuns. I don't know. I mean, we're, luckily, gear 12, they don't hurt as bad as the higher relics. Of course, it has your, there we go. They still hurt, but they don't hurt as much. There we go. Come on. Okay. And Maul gets going to the races. Luckily, we have our adapter die. Yeah, they're not hurting nearly as bad. Uh, I guess, oh, I have the Omicron. I forgot about that. I, well, that was my latest Omicron. All right, the question is, though, am I going to be able to... I, I just I feel like I'm not dropping enough damage on these fools. I mean, we're surviving. That's cool, but I'm not putting nearly as much on them that I would like. Here we go. Okay. All right. Here we go. All right, I'm back. There we go. Nice hit. Nice hit. Okay. Oh, we're right there. And that's what I don't want. All right, come on. Heal up. Back online. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Bigger hits. I need bigger hits. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. We're getting there. I think we're getting there. Slowly but surely. Here we go. All right. Damage mini popped on. All right. Now we have that damage mini. Now we just got to wait, basically. Give me some protection up to hold us off for a minute. All right. We got to... No, we just got to keep waiting. There we go. Give us some buffs. Ooh, there we go. Buff the spell. There we go. All right. Now the question is, can Maul maybe take out some folks if we don't have him attacking out of turn? There we go. Pull back his turn. Ooh, hold on. Hold on. All right. I got to say this one... I was not expecting a full banner win on that one. There we go. All right. That was a little mildly surprising. Mildly surprising. I wasn't expecting my gear toll Vida to make that work. Okay. Now we have Mon Mothma. Now we don't have Wampa anymore at our disposal. Um, we're going to go down a different route here. We can maybe do Hux here. So maybe Hux might be a good option. Uh, yeah, let's just do Hux. Again, shoot from the hip. Make plays happen. That's all I'm looking for. First order. Let's get Hux here. Boom, boom. Get, just throw on the Omicron too. Probably should save the Omicron. We don't got time. Hey, do I even have, have any? Have any? These are all very useless to me. All right, let's keep moving. Baby Kylo can do it. Uh, that sounds like a lot of time, man. That sounds like a whole. I'm just. I'm going with this. It sounds. I, I'm not doubting you. I know we've done a few Mon Mothma battles, but man, I feel like they, those can take a minute. It's fine. Let's keep us moving. Just keep us moving. All right, let's just see if I can blitz down. Kyle, like so, he's like, this is just a lot faster. 
This is a lot faster. Uh, give me some advantage on us. All right, let's... Um... I don't want to lose my... Oh, we just lost the advantage. So probably should have just passed. Oh, you got it. Oh, come on. Seriously? Seriously, Ben. You just... You just... You, you, you couldn't die a peaceful death. Okay, fine. Oh, come on. There we go. Come on. Oh, wow. 50,000 hugs. That's a, that was a little odd. All right, there we go. And send it to the bank. Oh, come on. Oh, no, no. We're not doing this again. One time, five. Two times, no. All right, 57. Lock it in. Lock it in. All right, next up here. Do we want to use Jedi Knight Luke Skywalker on this Count Dooku team? We also have a Commander Luke Skywalker split at our disposal. I'm feeling, I'm feeling, um, uh, feeling a little Jedi -y here. So we do Jedi here. Uh, and then, uh, or maybe what we could do, what's that? What was that Kyle team? Maybe Jedi here. We do some sort of Luke split up here. I think, yeah, maybe we'll do Han Chewy here. All right. And then we'll do Jedi. Let's do Jedi Luke here. This could be a minute, but that's fine. We'll make it work. We'll make it work. Give me some Jedi. You, you, and. I don't like bad. Too many debuffs. Yeah, screw it. We'll just go with it. All right, let's go. Give me some music playing. Three, two, one, Luke. We're going to do a couple of Luke things here. We're going to do a Jedi Luke. Then we're going to do a Commander Luke. I just didn't want to do Commander Luke on this battle. All right, well, I have to wait for a second. That's fine. Let's get to work. All right, good stuff. Let's go ahead, drop that stun, lock him in, and get taunt up. All right, we got the combo popping. Let's get that officer out. He should be the easiest to nuke. Let's go pop this over to Hermit Yoda. There we go. Good stuff. Give me a Billy Block. Lock him in. And we got one. Give me some Foresight. All right, Foresight locked in. Get baby Kylo out first. There we go. Come on, come on. No, oh, no, I need so many better hits. Magic hand thing coming in. Looking good. Basic. In the yellow. One. There we go. Okay. Yeah, if you guys notice as well, during the off season, took my Ben to gear 12. We're working towards that Jedi Master Luke. And we're like, you know what? I use Ben quite a lot in 5v5 for Star Killer. And hey, can use him here in 3v3 too. There we go. Full auto. Yeah, we got it. Easy money. Okay. 57. Keep the money coming, baby. All right, next up here, I think we'll probably do, let's do Han Chewie here, as he said. Scoundrels, I, I, don't, I don't like this, but part of me thinks we can maybe pull off a first order thing here. All right, just let's go, let's go. Hopefully it'll be fine. Let's try to nuke Dooku first. Droidica, we gotta make sure it doesn't sauce me up. Yeah, let's nuke out Dooku. There we go. Oh, give me a stun here, please and thank you, right? We're gonna, yeah, give me a stun. And of course. Uh, Magna Guard's not gonna take a turn from it. Let's do this. There we go. Uh, get me the stun here. There we go. Give this over to, let's give it to, 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 to. We gotta make sure we get out. Uh, yeah, we gotta make sure we get him out. Let's go past this turn over here. There we go. Give me out. Oh, come on. Ah. Uh, we gotta buff the spell though. That's fine. Buff the spell. And we're gonna get stuck behind this dude now. All right. Oh gosh. What is with this near death experience stuff going on? There we go. That's fine. That's fine. Steal my banners. All right. 56. All right. And then Hux. We can probably. I wanna. Maybe we should save Luke. This feels a little overkill for him. Let's go first order. I think I have some other first order members we can throw down here. We can do you, you, Panda. This feels pretty good. Not a lot of damage cooking there. I don't think we're gonna do a Kylo Soul anywhere. Let's go. Keep it moving, baby. Woo! All right. Keep us moving along here. Crank it up a little bit. Let's get that Hux down. All right, let him get that advantage off him. All right, we're gonna have to get around this taunt. Luckily, we have two buff the spells. All right, on the Hux, let's get going. There we go, get that dominance off. Come on. There we go. Oh, give me a stun. No, stun. Uh, I just can't do this. Keep working him down. I know we could have gotten the taunt back, but it's fine. Get him down. All right, he's gone. Easy money. Throw it on auto. Throw it on auto. All right. Um, all right, top side. Wait, wait, this is the last team down here? The top side, we can, we're going to have to probably do Star Killer up against the Perimeter Kylo. Without, without Imperial Troopers, man, I don't... I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get through to Darth Revan. Um, yeah, I think we might have a complication there. All right, 56, and then let's go hop over here and see what we got. Why do I hate Vader so much? I don't hate him. I just not really a great opportunity to use him yet. Maybe we gotta. Maybe we'll have to do something funny here on that Star Killer. All right, we could do Vader here. 
Vader here, Supremeter Kylo, question marks, question marks, question marks. I definitely, I feel, I'm feeling like I'm hitting, we're gassing out. I feel like we're running out of ammo. Uh, but let's do this. We have to have Star Killer pop this. And then. Yeah, this, this is. I. Oh. Maybe I should have seen if I can make Commander Luke take down the Jedi Master Luke. Oh, well. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. Let's get to work. Let's go drop in Mara Jade. Get me Star Killer. We need this to work. I have no other window of opportunity here. Um. Yeah, we're gonna have to figure it out. Should I say J. Kel? Yeah. Um, probably. What would I have used to take down the J the Kylo Ren? I don't know, right? Off the top of my head. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. Yeah, Jedi Knight Luke probably could have taken down that Darth Revan. Uh, all right, well, no need to cry for spilt moof milk. We gotta keep moving along here. Let's get Larry out of here, and then we'll just go all in on Kylo. Very easy battle, straightforward. Nothing too much to complain about here. Uh, yeah, just go all in. All in, let's get him. Let's get him. Let's get him, get him, get him. Drop that in, let's go. Get my stacks pumping and thumping. Ooh, do I wanna try to get an, let's see if we can try to get another turn meter push. Yeah, there we go. Not that much of a push, but we got a little bit. All right, Kyle's gonna try to do a little swipey swipe. That's fine. Let's go drop some shocks. There we go, get me to buff the spell here in a moment. All right, come on, buff the spell. Nicely done, all right. Palpatine eating it up like hot cakes, baby. We got it. We got it. Basic. All right. Easy. Yeah, without Hawks. Pfft. Simple matchup. Okay. Um, Vader here. Let's do what we can do with Vader. I, I swear to goodness. You better get the job done here. Better get the job done. Yeah, I, I think I'm going to have to accept the fact I may have misplaced my team a little bit on this one today. Um, Vader, do I trust you going all by yourself? No, I don't trust you. I don't trust anybody. Solo, uh, I'm gonna play it safe. Let's just throw in the Royal Guard, make sure we get through this. Anything good, armor penetration, sure. Let's do it. All right, get in there, Bader. No choking! I know in 3v3, for some reason, it just feels off. 5v5, there's a, there's a rhythm. In 3v3, I don't know, for some reason, I feel like this matchup's harder. All right, let's get to work. Let's get there. All right. Um, b -b 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 can you give me a kill? And of course, that's just, what's up all these? So many near-death experiences today. All right, well, yeah, like, I, I feel like I need that culling blade, like, right there. Okay, all right, I see how we're gonna play this. <sighs> Tonto. All right, can, the, can you kill someone off, please? Kill them off. Oh, what is with this man? Like, that, so many in the red moments. Royal Guard, you better do something, man. Oh, what did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Now, how the hell am I supposed to beat that now? Oh my gosh, probably should've just had Thrawn. Should've just played that so much simpler. Ay, 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 Okay, well, that was less than ideal there. <sighs> just shut up, Vader! Yeah, you're choking on your Porsche, that's all you do. <sighs> that sucks. That sucks mildly. Should've, yeah, I probably should've just thrown in Thrawn. Like, what am I gonna use Thrawn for? Probably not much, unless we're gonna do something of Darth Revan. Uh, that's the only thing I could think of. All right, well. Uh, all right well here's what i'm probably gonna do we're gonna just use darth revan here how fast are you 226 all right let's do darth revan over here am i fast enough to out just outrun them all right we're fast uh let's just throw a thrawn just now might as well use the thrawn now that we have it all right you you and you okay just get in there goodness gracious can't lead yeah a little bit odd uh, i mean it's not a bad lead it's just you know yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Drop it in. Give me the fear. All right. Keep locking him in. All right. Let's go ahead. Start working down this piet. There we go. Got the shock locked in. There we go. Death mark should be popping. Nicely done. Pass it back on over. Don't you dare steal my beautiful baby banners here. Come on. Do that. Another ability block. There we go. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. There we go. He down. Throw that on. All right. Drop the fracture and get out of here. All right. Probably could have honestly Captain Faz with that, but it's whatever. At this point, I'm just trying to get these kills in because I feel like I'm under killing these right now. Oh, man. All right. How many teams do I got left? I have a Phasma. I have a Luke. And that's kind of it. So we're not getting a full clear. So we need to hope that my opponent also does not full clear. Will they? I don't know. It depends. 
So we need to make sure he pick... I think... I think... I would like to have Faza beat this so Luke can beat something else. That would be my ideal wish. Uh, it's not ideal. But we're going to have to make it work. We have to make it work. Phasma and Light, yeah, that's the game plan. Then Luke, maybe the Geos. And then we'll save that. We could use that for just Commander Luke. And uh, this is completely useless for me, but we'll just throw it on. Just so it feels good. All right, Phasma. We need a new gunner, man. It's getting out of hand right now. All right. Okay, let's get down to business. Pump me that turn meter. Okay, let's get, uh, you know, get me. There we go. Nice double assist. I'll take it. I'll take it. Taunt up. Okay, we can't be critically hit while we have an advantage. We need a little bit more attacks on the turns, though. We gotta get Han out first. All right, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, a little bit. There we go. Beautiful. We got it. We got it. Let's get Lando out next. Then we'll focus on Leia at the end. Buff unit a little bit annoying. It's fine. We'll deal with it. You know what? Screw it. Just go on on Leia. She's asking for it. She's asking for it. There we go. Nice counters. Come on. Come on. Turn meter. Nice. Nicely done. All right, cool. Good stuff. All right. Glad we were able to do that. And yeah, I don't feel confident in Commander Loop up against, up against Darth Revan. Yeah, I feel like I was just one team inefficient. All right. Yeah, I, I'm not going to get Luke to beat that. So we're going to go... Go this. Right? Yeah, yeah I, I feel like... I'm just trying to think, what would I have used on the, the Kylo? All right, well, we'll have to do a post-game review and see what I would, would have done here. Oh, we can't use the data crown here. All right, whatever. It is what it is. Okay. Keep it going. Let's go. It's interesting trying to have to, like, work through the new dynamic of having... I think I had to put three more teams down on defense. Yeah, I think it was three. Then that means I need three more on offense. So it makes things a little bit more interesting. Okie dokie. Let's just try to get as many turns as we can. Get me rolling. Get me some. All right, now I was hoping for a buff unity. Of course not. Well, then we'll try some confusion. All right. Come on. Get me. You know, he's just going to cleanse this off in a second. So I'm not even going to bother. Just hit him with this. Okay. Let him get the cleanse going. I'm just a little bit worried. Uh, Gear 12 Wookie does not feel good. It doesn't. All right. Let's try to. Boom, boom. Oof, that was not good. That's the one downside of going into a different mode. Too many debuffs can stick on me. There we go. All right, there we go. That's good. Let's get that spy out while I can maybe make something happen. There we go. There we go. Looking good, looking good. Keep pushing back. There we go. Nice dodge, nice dodge. All right, let's get out of this stance. Okay, I think we got it. There we go. All right. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Keep pushing. There we go. Oh, come on. A little bit further. A little bit further. Give me a stun. We got the stun. Beautiful. Oh, come on. No, don't get out. Of it. Just, just, just get out. Just come on. There we go. Good, 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 good. All right. Um, Yeah, I think I'm out of teams. Definitely. I think, yeah, the, the, the Kylo battle is the most inefficient. I probably should have. I think I could have maybe figured out a way to get like Darth Vader to have beaten that. So that was the only thing I think I could have misplayed. Let's assume they're going to get through ships. Hey, are we going to be enough in the win? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. So let's say to get 914, and then they get the 219. Uh, and then let's say they get like 70 banners on the executor. All right. So basically, they have to get through the executor and Jabba. And I don't know if they have the firepower to get through the Jabba. They put the Primitive Kyle Ren down. They put Jedi Master Luke down. Not like Jedi Master Luke's a great counter to Jabba. But um, Supreme Leader Kyron would have been their best answer. And I'm hoping I forced out a Sith Eternal versus Sith Eternal matchup. Let me see. Is there anything they maybe they have that I'm not aware of that could maybe get through a job, especially the Data Cron as well that we have? Uh, I don't. I'm not seeing it. We'll have to find out. I guess we'll know in about an hour. I Do they have Night Sisters up and running? It's the only thing I can maybe imagine it can. No, not really. So I think we might be good. I think we got it. Even if they get through ships, which is, they could make it happen. I think they have finalizers. So let's see the first order ships. Yeah, they, they have the counter. So I think they could get through it. Maybe they don't have it. I don't know. I'm not sure what their ship split was. I was really looking forward to it. All right. A lot of fun. Definitely. We got to you know work out a few kinks with the new defensive offense strategies and expansions. And I want to come back later and see what my other opponents like. Because this felt pretty competitive for a uh, for Grand Arena. Normally, it's, again, we're outclassed by millions of GP and multi-GLs. This was 
almost on the nose. I mean, barring they had Gas, Malik, uh, Mal, 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 Malgus, and Maul, it felt pretty balanced between the two of us. All right. Now we get to the main platter. That was just a little bit of a dessert. Strong work, thank you. I, you know, I'm not gonna pat myself on the back. I screwed up a little. I was a little rushy, rushy. The Jedi Knight Luke was the battle that we could have saved. I think we could have easily taken down the Darth Revan, but you know, we know for next time, let's be a little bit, again, we gotta be a bit more conservative. And I, I know we'll see how I feel about keeping Sith Eternal on defense. All right, the main attraction. Dark side versus light side Grand Arena Challenge. It's been a minute since we had the opportunity. I don't get many opponents that wanna, you know, get off the hamster wheel of Grand Arena. So can we please, big special thank you on so many levels to our opponent, Micah! <laughs> Inside of the X-Wing Fighter Guild. Uh, and a big shout out to Toyota. Are you here, Toyota? If Toyota's here, make sure you say happy birthday and a big thank you, uh, Toyota. If I didn't see Toyota's message that this guy was trying to reach out, this wouldn't have happened. So big thank you for Micah for being the one to initiate the conversation and wanting to do this. And furthermore, thank you to Toyota. Happy birthday. Thank you for making sure it got on my radar. And Mike on asks if we can give a shout out to his kids. Gary, what do we got here? So he says, uh, so tell him me. Thanks and enjoy. Please give a shout out to my guild. My Alliance Rebel Alliance. And a big shout out to his kids. Hopefully they're here watching, having a good time. I think we're gonna have a little back and forth action. His kids, Izzy. Ellie, Caitlin, and Abby! My oh my oh my! That sounds like a big beautiful family right there. Again, Mike, I'm looking forward to the fun that we're gonna have and I appreciate you coming out here. Wanted to have some fun, asking if I wanted to do something special. And it's been a minute. We, I, I can't remember when the last time we did a sandbox challenge type of thing, so. And I, I like this guy too, because like this would have been a good matchup. Normally we have about the same GP, we have about the same data cron. So it would have been a pretty nice competitive grand arena. But we're gonna have a little bit more fun. Is Mike on the chat? I'm not sure if he's here. Hopefully he's here. Last I checked, he didn't do anything on offense. So I think we might go back and forth here. There he goes. So we might have a little back and forth action. So let me summarize the rules in case you missed at the beginning. We are doing dark side on offense, light side defense, mainly because I wanted to see Bo-Katan on defense and no Galactic Legends, and way more importantly, no Data Crowns, getting that trash out of here. So I wanna just show you real quick what I imagined a non-Galactic Legend Data Crown world, and if CG wanted to do something fun and do light side defense, here's what I'm thinking. So Captain Rex is gonna be great, especially since we're not gonna be able to use Qui-Gon on offense. This could be a little challenging to beat, so really curious to see how that's gonna pan. I think he did something similar. I did CLS of Drogon, and 3PO and Chewie, not sure if that's gonna be that good. We'll see. Uh, we have ourselves the uh, resistance. We have gas. I only thing I hesitate, that's definitely not the best gas lineup, but it enables me to do a pretty solid split. And what I'm really curious about, my opponent has Bo as well. How is Bo Katan on defense in 3v3? And then we'll have to see what she's like on offense as well. And then let's go take a look at the North. Oh, wait, oh my gosh, we have Grandmaster Veers with the $2 saying, thank you, my God. Yes, thank you indeed. I'm still gonna be a little behind on the super chats. Uh, you guys know how I roll. Appreciate your patience. We'll definitely catch up at the end. I wanna make sure we get as much fun as we can in this next hour. And then of course, Henry Nelson as well. Thank you so much for the five pounds. Watched your video since 2019 slash finally downloaded the game last year. No kidding, you've been watching that long and just started downloading it? Wow, that's crazy. Hey, that means a lot to me that you're still, you've been hanging out, what, four or five years and didn't even play the game, that means a lot. Uh, you unlocked your first GL SLKR, speed set or offset, speed set all day. Speed set, throw on some uh, critical damage or on uh, the triangle offense on the cross. Speed, baby, speed, you need him fast. You need him ramping up as quickly as possible. And then shout out to my wife, Gosha. Happy Gosha to you. Thank you so much, Henry. Hope you and the wife are doing well. And thanks again for being around for so long and supporting me. It really means a lot, wow. 2019, didn't even play the game till recently. Oh my gosh, we have Jack with the $10 one more. 10 cheers for any opponent who is up for having some oddball fun in Grand Arena. 10 out of 10, and that's what I'm saying. Like, I feel like at times, especially with Datacrons and lately, you know, we're on the hamster wheels. Like everyone's, you know, they, we're, we're being good pets for CG, chasing the Datacrons, the Galactic Legends. This is fun, man. Just taking a break, doing something creative and different. It's like, man, I would love to have more opportunities. So that's when we get the opportunity, I got to capitalize on it because we don't get many of them. Uh, Rogue One, I also put that on defense. Qui-Gon Jinn, 
and check out my unaligned forest user team so we can't use malikos on defense because he's dark side right so i i don't know if this is gonna be super threatening i'm curious to see commander tano with seer and cal it sounds deadly and then we have a jedi knight luke comp uh then best garmando han and chewy and nothing too crazy in the back nothing that's gonna really throw my opponent off but uh, that's what i'm thinking but let's see what my opponent had in mind here a couple things i, I thought i was like oh i did not think about that so pretty typical stuff qui-gon cls rogue one jedi Knight revan and this was their bo katan lineup i i guess we'll see which one feels better they went for baby Bo. i feel like grogu would be the better one buff the spells um but i get bow you get more recovery when you're attacking out of turn um thicker team so I, 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 we'll see you know again first three three of bow i just i i thought we, everyone was on the same page grogu but who knows maybe they're using grogu for something else potentially uh and then let's see what we got here and then we have ourselves shorty this was a bit odd i was not this is a weird cal team remember cal outside of territory battles his lead is not the greatest but it's not like okay it's not the greatest for greater is i i was not expecting a cal to be used in a leadership capacity i feel like maybe mace windu would have been a better lead let me see um maybe not yeah they're just like yeah it's like or even like using keller and beck here is kind of interesting i thought maybe they could have done like a keller and split so let we'll the wait and see curious to see how that would work cal is just kind of an idiot on defense and we have zori there's their captain rex and then they have a Jedi Luke as well so the, we got to take care of the first thing how do we deal with Bo-Katan Mandalore in a 3v3 I so we got to be cautious of a few things I probably don't feel confident throwing my Malgus up against this right bro stop stalling you know, I have an hour I'm just going over the defense we're not stalling listen they haven't started we're gonna go back and forth we're gonna have a good time no rush no rush so I kind of already ideated roughly what I imagine my offense split for dark side would be so we have inquisitors i don't think we want to use that on bow bow seems to be a very good counter against inquisitors i don't feel good about malgus as much as i would like to do maul for a thematic purse i think bow would dunk on that i think bow would dunk on that i think bow would dunk on gideon i have this malikos split uh i'm wondering if maybe palpatine's my answer i i think tria might be the answer though i think this might be our best uh Aphra might be okay too. I, I think this might be the battle for Treya because uh, from what I could tell, Bo doesn't do well up against Treya in 5v5. Too many attacks out of turn, buffs out of turn. So it seems like this should favor us here. Yeah, Treya or Malgus. I, 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 I don't know if I feel confident. Malgus, Treya, Bo does pretty well up against uh, when she's on offense. So I think I'm going to go with this. I think that's what I'm going to do. All right, let's do it. St uh, Treya, you up for the challenge? Let's go get the party rolling. Hey, Gary, can you know what? I, I know we have Treya, but we already played the Treya song earlier. Can we? No, I don't want to do Savage song. Let, let's get the Bo song. This is her moment. Let's see what she looks like in her natural, normal, intended state with no data crons, none of that funny business. Let's see what we can do with it. You ready for it? You missed my super chat. You know how it goes. I, I'm going to go. I'm going to roll. I know I'm behind. As I said, I'm sorry. I appreciate your patience, but I will keep up, Ryo. At the end of the Grand Arena, we do our little chill segment and catch up with y'all. So thank you for your patience. I know I suck. Tell me something I don't know. All right. Let's get to it. I'll be I'll be actually very surprised if Bo shuts this down. I think this should be the best counter. We have afforded to us here. Okay. All right. Days Let's never feels good. Simple. That doesn't feel great. Uh, we're gonna have to go on that. Oof. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ooh, God, I clenched my butt a little bit there. That did not feel good. We need to get the isolate going here. All right, isolate. There we go. All right, got around that. We have to get bow down. We have to. All right. <laughs> okay. That was fast. I I I, I think this. Ooh. I really think my Malgus would have been manhandled in this battle. Yeah, I, I think this is the best call. Yeah, <laughs> that was a pretty scary play. They, I was close to losing. Like, I, I, I really believe if they had Grogu, I think they probably could have blitzed down my Nihilus. There we go. And there we go. Knock him down. Take it to the bank. All right, we got it. Whew. Whew. Yeah, I think this would have been a much different world. Grogu comes in, gets that bow assist. Ooh, we may have lost uh, lost our beloved Sith Lord, but I think this was pr 
Like, honestly, I don't know if there would have been another great counter to this, except maybe Dr. Effort and Star Killer. I don't think Reva would have done well here. Beautiful. Didn't even get a chance at that bonus turn. We'll take it. All right. That was underwhelming, but I think I brought the premier counter for Bo. I think that's why I felt underwhelming. But if I would have thrown Malgus, I think we would have lost. <laughs> we would have lost someone important there. All right. Next team. Ooh. All right. We can... Um... Oh, man. It, it feels so weird because like, I was just about to say, oh, I'll do this. But wait, I don't have those dark side teams. We got to get a little creative here. Why don't we try to do a Darth Revan split? We could do Darth Revan here. And then we'll use Malgus somewhere else. So I say... We can probably do like Malgus here, Darth Revan here. All right, I'm feeling it. Let's go for it. Knight Sister on Qui Gon. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. So I think Darth Revan might be ideal on this battle. Uh, I mean, we could also, you know, what? I could probably Imperial. You know what? Imperial Troopers might be the better option. Let me see. How fast are we? 314. That's an interesting mod set. What was that? I mean, he got decent speeds on. Huh? Yeah, decent speeds, even though no speed set. Interesting. Potency, crit chance, and health. Hmm, interesting. Uh, I think, I think, I think I, we can make Imperial Troopers get a dunk here. Because there's not many opportunities for Imperial Troopers. So I think this might be... This might be the opportunity here. As long... Uh, do Night Sisters work on Qui-Gon? Uh, and 5 5 made it work, but boy, is it sketchy. Sometimes, you're one nuke away from <laughs> getting obliterated. But I, it's possible. Yeah, I... I Where's those in? Where's the Veers Trooper team? Where are you at? Where did I, I know I put you in here somewhere? There you are. I think this should work. I think we are just going to have to target Bastila first. Or do we go Jolie first? Hmm. I know we've done this many a times on the free to play count. But usually it's <laughs> they're usually lower gear, not full on relic aid. I can go Jolie, but man, it's going to take a minute. I think we can go Jolie. Jolie's the least threatening to take a bonus turn. All right. Trench, please. He's my favorite. Don't worry. We're probably going to use Trench somewhere. I don't know if we're going to use it here. Although, it's, no, let's go. Get the get this, get this these guys in here. I, I I don't know why. I'm feeling slightly hesitant on this play. But I, I'm going to do it, and we're going to, like, freaking nuke him. And I'm going to be like, yeah, I'm a genius. <laughs> let's do things one step at a time, though. All right. Send it. If this doesn't work, I'll, I'll give you Trench. How does that sound? I just feel like we could do Darth Revan somewhere in a, in a better capacity. All right. Okay, let's go ahead. Ooh, I'm hoping we get enough turn meter from this. We should. Yeah, we're going to need to pump a little bit. All right, we need to get rolling. Okay. All right. Oh, come on. There we go. All right, there's that. Okay. Oof. We should be able to get another turn, right? I think we should just go for finish off Jolie. Let's just finish off Jolie. Come on, one more, one more, baby. One more, one more. There's the turn meter, honey. All right, we're, we're moving, we're moving. Um, Basla looks like the easier kill here. Let's go for it. <laughs> I'm a genius! Give me the buff this spell. Got the days locked in. Don't you dare steal my banners. And let's take him home. Nicely done. Yeah, way better. Because you're not going to find many windows for troopers to get the job done. I, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. All right. And my count. Shout out to the party. 65 banners. What did they take down? Let's see. Check it down the south, I'm guessing. I'm guessing they probably did the same thing as me. Oh, they, they're going north first. Okay. They're going north. All right. They went for the Qui-Gon banner first. All right. So we're going a little bit different. Different paths here. I want to get that south locked and then we'll... Oh, work our way over to the north side. All right, next up here, Qui Gon Jedi. A lot of you guys seem to want to see my Night Sisters in action here. Uh, I mean, I. I think I could use Night Sisters in a better capacity. Um. All right. Oh, uh, yeah, man. Dealing with Qui Gon, you're normally like, oh, just Bad Batch, but we don't have Bad Batch at our disposal. Dark Chirper, Gideon should do fine. I don't know when I'm going to use this team. Like, I can't tell this is going to be a great team or a pretty lackluster team. Don't want to use that here. Gosh, I wish I could trust Trench, but I don't. You're done. Don't want to use Tuskins here. A little worried about that. GG can win sometimes. Oh, God, I hate using Grievous. I hate using him. All right, hold on. If we're going to pick Night Sisters, I was considering we could do 
We could maybe utilize Night Sisters on the Luke. We could probably also do Tuskins on. We could probably do Tuskins Luke. You know what? I think. Yeah. What's the most turn meter heavy team? Because we got to use Tuskins somewhere. And I think Tuskins um, might be best off on Luke. Any other turn meter related teams? Uh, we could maybe do Tuskins on the that. Hmm. I don't know if I'm gonna want to do it there. All right. I think. Well, let's do Tuskins on CLS. And then I'll. Then I'll. Man, you guys really want to see Trench in action. All right. Well, let me see how I feel in a moment. But let's go do this. Tuskins uh, should lock this battle in for us. Tuscan baby, where are you at? Boom, boom, boom. All right, we have Omicron dialed in. This should be pretty good, right? No Datacrons, nothing fun like that. New B1 Django. Oh, gosh. I know it works. I've done it before, but man, I just never feel... I don't have the high degree of confidence that some of you guys might have. Anyways, let's get to work. Bantha time. All right, let's get under Tuscans. This should be easy. I actually feel like this might be overkill for Tuscans, but who knows? Give me a little bit of a fight. Let me feel good that I'm using Tuscans here. All right, let them get that terminator rolling. Let's go start with some of this. All right, nicely done. Good stuff, good stuff. And there goes. Man, I haven't used Tuskins on offense in a minute, man. Look at all those stuns. Oh, man. This feels good. This feels nice. Just plunk them out. Do I, do I, want, to, do I want to plunk or do I want to dunk? I want to dunk. Do the dunk. Boom. All right, you gone. All right, give me some more of those juicy stuns. Oh, man, the banner's looking good. Hold the phone. Do some of this. I will teach yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna ride this run. home. Oh. Oh. Nice, oh. God. I feel like that was overkill, huh? We'll take it though. All right, all right. Like a Benza. All right, gosh. All right, I'm feeling the energy for Trench. Okay. Who is the community like number one Trench guy that claims that Trench can beat every Galactic Legend? Tell me right now. What is the lineup? So I don't hear that was the wrong trench line. Just like anytime I pick any trench line, oh, that wasn't the right trench line. It's like, what, what do you mean? There's only five people to pick from. I have everything. I whatever you guys want, I'll make it happen. Do we want to use what? I just I feel like Newt is just a better counter to this then. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's Sep. Yeah, Sep is the he's the best trench player. He's so good. He hasn't even geared up trench yet. <laughs> sitting at unlocked, uh, sitting locked <laughs> in his roster. I would assume Dooku Django, but not my call. Oh gosh. Ugh, I just, I'm gonna get nuked in like the first second here, man. Oh, it's been a minute since I played this game, man. You know, you can have fun. You hop in, have some fun with us, you know? <sighs> All right, how about this? Why don't we just rely on the power of science here? And so, because everyone seems to have a different trench opinion here. All right, let's go 3v3 counters. What is the almighty data telling me? If I want to flex my trench, take trench off the bench and watch Qui-Gon get drenched, what are we feeling here? Qui-Gon! Qui-Gon, you, you. All right, trench baby. What magical plays can you make happen for me? Jeez, oh, 45% win rate. That's not... That's not the most exhilarating. Oh gosh. Um. Oh gosh, even worse. Uh, yeah, this this was this was my initial hunch using Watt and Dooku. But that was a cleanup. I don't want cleanups. No cleanups. Ah, oh, jeez. Jeez, these are these are not great battles. <laughs> these are not great. Oh, all right, how about the uh, Django? Oh gosh, these just don't look good. Like, isn't just Newt Gunray just a better counter? If I wanted to go down this route. Yeah, look at how is it Newt Gunray is a better counter than freaking Trench. All right, I'd say let's let's go with this. Even though I, I'm not a fan of it, I know it works, but it's just all right. Yeah, I, I just take off the Jedi Data Crons. Uh, let's see, no Data Crons. Boy, good luck finding data on that. Yeah, we actually, there's actually not a bad. Oh, that's the new battle. Oh, All right, Trench, come on. There's only 11 battles that use Trench with no data crowns on either side. And it's looking like I mean, this doesn't really tell me much. I mean, you had one person that won here, one person that won there. That does not tell me anything of super high value. All right. Let's go. Oh, I, 
<laughs> I don't know, man. Uh, all right, what was the... Okay, fine. I'll, I'll, I'll give you the trench because I have no idea where I'm going to use it. Uh, what are we saying? Um, Newt gun race seems to be the common denominator. If there is any denominator to pull from. All right, I feel best about this. Uh, trench, Newt, Watt. That's what I'm... Uh, yeah, I mean, it's going to be Watt or Dooku. I feel like Dooku just is better, right? Stuns, shocks, ability blocks. That feels best for me. All right, my Relic 9 Trench. Okay. <laughs> hey, we're here to have fun. Let's just go with it. You know what? If he does something, I'm excited for him. Trench, it's time to get off the bench, and it's time to wipe off this disgusting stench. Here we go. You ready for it? All right. Am I going to get nuked in the first play? I guess we'll find out. And the worst part is, if this wor loses, then I don't have Newt at my disposal. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Oh, man, what do I want to do here? My Duke is about to be yeetified. That was a good, that was a good stun on Katamundi, though. Oh. Do I want to do basics? I bet they can, Qui Gon's going to come in and probably nuke him out. Can this be avoided? I don't know. I, I think basic's got to be my answer here. It has to be the answer. All right, please do something. And that's exactly what I was expecting. Oh, boy. Well, um... All right, well, uh, we'll have to run with it. Let's just run with it. All right, let's try to get some extortion moving around. Oh, God, not a... Uh, I was really hoping for something. All right, there we go. Okay. Um, go over here. Here we go. Hmm. God, you gotta, you, it's, just, it's like defusing a bomb right now. I, I want to just jack his cooldowns up and try to get a shock on him. Okay. And I swear to goodness, you better not do the taunt. We gotta just get him out. Just get him out. Just get him out. I know this is gonna hurt, but just. I know it's gonna. Oh, God. Uh, all right, at least Qui Gon's gone. Um, I don't know if we're gonna survive much longer here. <laughs> I just absolutely hate this character with a burning passion, man. Uh, maybe, maybe what I don't know. What could have died just as easily? I don't know what the better call would have been. Um, Dooku dying in the first play. I, I feel like if Dooku didn't get nuked in the first minute, I think I could have won that. Oh, well, we're gonna keep going with it. Oh, all right. Qui Gon's gone. All right. Let's let's just let's get the clean up here. Let's do the. Uh, well, <laughs> can't just be any cleanup because we know that these two like to cause mayhem sometimes. So what do we have? Oh, oh man. Oh, man. Mm, Django. Let's not. I'm not even going to goof here. Let's just send in like some. Let's like send in some legit people. Here we go. Send it out in. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Let's get Boba Fett number two in here. <sighs> Freaking trend. <laughs> Never use them again. And today's an exception because this is today's all about a fun sandboxy experience. You know, that's all we're doing. We're, we're here to stretch our legs, have some fun with MyCon. What? Because again, what am I gonna do? Trench otherwise? Embo lead? Hell no. Screw Embo lead. I don't want to break the game. That's why I'm not using Embo lead. All right, let's keep moving. Why are you playing the bad bitch song? No, no, there's no bad bitch on the field right now. Holy crap! All right, let's nuke him. Crank it up. Get in there. Get in my way. Don't, 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 don't get in my way. Guys, keep moving. Oh, uh, don't you dare. Don't you. No. 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 All right, we got that taken care of. Let's keep moving along. Okay. Redis. All right, light side or dark side counter to Redis. Um. Dark side counter to Redis. 
Don't want to use Gideon. We know that. That's uh, Rad is kind of hard counters him. What am I going to use? I, I, I don't know how good this team is. I, uh, this is such a... Uh, yeah, I, I, I want to use it somewhere. I just don't know where. Don't want to use Night Sisters. We can, do I want to use Afra? That feels a little overkilly. Maul? Uh, that doesn't, is this an exciting use of Maul? I don't know. We're six minutes left. Oh, we're fine. We're, listen, we're both cruising at the same speed. Don't worry. Don't worry. We're having a good time, baby. Um, or about the uh, only downside of bounty hunters, man. It's like, you know, you got to fight that. I feel like what's my bounty hunters looking like? Do I? Oh, we don't have. We can't use Mando. So scratch that. Never mind. We're not using Mando. I mean, I'm not really seeing any other clear answer here. And I don't want to use like Malgus or something like that. That's a bit overkill. All right. Uh, you guys like Maul? Yeah. Knights is here. I, I'm, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I thought Redis does fairly well up against Night Sisters. Iden? Oh boy, isn't Redis literally the Iden counter? I'm going to go. Let's. Uh, I don't know. This doesn't feel exciting for me. Yeah, Maul feels a little overkill. What's more overkill? Using Malgus or using Maul? Uh, I want to save Malgus in case there's like a Dar, uh, General Anakin Skywalker, maybe. But we have Star Killer. We have options for that. At some point, we just got to like just kill him, something. All right. I, I guess we can maybe go. Yeah, Gar Super Commando. Yeah, I can't use Bad Batch here. I think I'm going to use Malgus. I feel like I'm not going to do as much this Malgus line because I'm doing a split. All right, Malgus. I'm going to laugh if somehow this, you know, hold on. I think I have Talon. Do I need Talon for anything else? I think Talon might be better than Sith Assassin. Yeah, let's go do this. Yeah, let's do that. I feel a little bit better about that. Can't use Empire. Why can't they use Empire? Why can't they use Empire? The, the, they're Mandalorians. All right, let's just go. Send it. I swear you better not lose against Radis. I'll be vastly disappointed in you. Crank it up. Get the work. I have All right. Broken my Can we just nuke? I'm not quite. Again. All right. All right. Come on. Let him do the work. Here we go. Revive got pulled out. All right. I'm. This is what I'm worried about. That taunt could be annoying. All right. We got around. Keep moving. There we go. We got some shocks. Fear popping, locking. Okay. Come on. I mm, feel like it's taking a minute to get to this Radis. Come on. Come on. I need, a, I need one more big nuke. One more nuke. We have returned. There we go. Moving along. Moving along. And that, one more turn for nuke. Hopefully I don't get stuck behind the K2. I'm going to get stuck behind the K2, aren't I? All right, we're good. We're good. Oh, come on. Oh, man, are we going to get stuck here? Come on, baby. Keep me moving along. There we go. Some shocks. Oh, 55. That's what, I, that's what I needed. Watch out for the exposes. A little scary. Come on. Almost there. And get a... Oh, ooh, big hit. Big hit. No, go under stealth. Go under stealth. Don't want to deal with the counterattack. All right. Almost down. Almost down. Okay. That should do it, right? Then quickly. On the gin. On the gin. Ah, shoot. Ah, shoot. Stuck behind. No, 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 no. All right. AoE. Come on. Probably should do this, right? I don't really use him on offense too often here. Hold up. Our time One has come. Ability block. There it is. Okay. All right. Oh, we got to watch out. Don't want. Come on. All right. Hopefully she doesn't crit me. Oh, we're good. Okay. No revive yet. Hold up. I have no idea what her cooldown's like. I think we got it. I think we got it. Come on, Malgus. You got this, baby. To the finish line. Give me Billy Blocks. There it is. Put her down. Put her down. Lock her in. Oh, block. Yeah. I feel like that was a lot harder than it needed to be. Okay. South wall down. South wall locked in for the Kyber Empire. That's a keep. Moving along. What's on the back wall before we get too carried away? Okay. Uh, we have gas on the back. Okay. We have ways to handle that. Uh, there's there. They went for that. Uh, we have Dash Rendar. Oh, Wampa. This could be Wampa food. We'll have to wait and see. Okay. 
I was like, there's no Galactic Legend in the back. No, duh, that's part of the rules, baby. All right, north side. <laughs> Isn't it funny how much easier, like smoother the Grand Arena goes? There's no data crowd. Like, oh my gosh, how do I deal with 120,000 deflection? And oh, it's like, it's like, I can, I know what's going to happen. Ah, oh, it feels good. All right, this team, I'm actually quite concerned about. Normally, Qui-Gon's your go-to counter. I don't know what I want to use here. Uh, actually, I know what I'm going to use. I'm feeling uh, Dark Trooper Gideon. Are we in agreement on this? Dark Trooper Gideon feels like it could be the best. It's a Terminator heavy team. We hopefully will have... This is my first time using Gideon, I think, in Grand Arena without a Datacron. So this will be interesting. How much is the Datacron masking his performance? Um, yeah, I would actually feel pretty good about this. I, th I don't know if there's a better battle... I just say, I don't know where, where the heck to use this team. I could use Malakos with the Inquisitors if I really need to. I think that's overkill. Uh, we could... All right, I think I'm going to go with this. I think I'm going to do it. Yeah. Where is the damage here? Uh, this? Oh, this is all about control. And then Captain Rex comes in with the damage. That's the problem. This team can loop you. They just Terminator, 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 Terminator. But Gideon likes when people get Terminator, so I think this should be good. Holy cow, Alex Otello coming at the 69, 69! <laughs> Whoa, caught the corner by Tactile Scanners. Give a round of applause. Wow, wow, wow. Super generous. Big yeah. When is your little sister uh, slanging the good stuff again? I need my fix. Oh my gosh, I have no idea. I could ask later on if we're doing another round of it. I think she says like once or twice a year. Uh, I, does the link still work? I think the order is closed. I don't know how Girl Scout cookies work. It's like the only, it's a limited time offer for $9.99. You snooze, you lose. I don't know how it goes, but I'll ask for you. Thank you so much. Wow, way too generous. And I want to thank you guys again. I know I already said thank you, but I really appreciate the support you gave my sister and her uh, troop of Girl Scouts. Uh, you guys always come through. It really means a lot. Goes towards great causes. Speaking of great causes, I want to cause mayhem panic. on this one. Suggest on my team? Your situation. I mean... To lay down your arm. The leader ability, I mean, it's, it's, it's so hard because we've been using Datacrons, and I've seen these guys hit for like 100,000 damage, but it's probably biased because of Datacrons. Uh, we could maybe do Death Trooper. Do we feel better about this? All right. Uh, uh, does, uh, does this feel a little bit better? Okay, Death Mark, damage. All right, we'll go with this. I need to replay the song. <laughs> I need, I need to feel the acute, uh, the, uh, the astute panic. Acute uh, panic. Do it again. All right, let's go for it. You're astute All right. Panic. Ready for it? Suggest that you I think I would have been fine of Gideon, situation. but we'll roll with this. I urge you to lay down your arms. Come outside. come outside. Let's do it. All right, let them get their turn meter. All right, so we probably want to try to nuke him out. We can I probably should save this, right? Let's get the taunt up. Let's do taunt. Okay. Cleanse. Nicely done. Let's pull back some turn meter. All right, they're going to roll again. They're Look at one damage. Where's my damage? Look at that. 42,000. All right, we're going to have to brute force our way through this guy. 48,000. I think I could have been fine with my other Gideon. Look at him, absolutely no damage. We just gotta watch out. The aerial advantage is the concern. Come on, ooh. Looks like uh, Captain Rex did a little bit of a savior thing there. Come on, keep pushing. Come on, keep pushing. There we go. Pretty much like no damage here. That's fine. All right, cleanse coming in. Man, uh, I'm, I'm worried about this aerial advantage right now. Crap. Didn't get through it fast enough. What's it gonna be? I wonder if OG Gideon would have been better. We would have had more assisting, more contermeter control. And of course, he killed the one guy I can't revive. Oh, this is going to be challenging. I don't think I'm going to get through this now with uh, this guy. What's it going to be? Oh. Come on. We, all right, we got to get rid of fives, I guess. He's just going to get in my way. Oh, all right. You know what? I'm going to put some air promo. This isn't looking good. Yeah. Um, shoot. I don't know how I'm going to beat this now. Uh, we might need to go down the Malakos route. That will bring order. Yeah, Ma that's one of my... I think I said this in my initial review. The biggest thing I hate about Dark Tomorrow Gideon, he really should be at minimum immune to percent damage effects, like plagues, damage over time, aerial advantage. I think that would be, like, just perfect. I'm not asking for much, but, like... 
I think if he would have had that, we would have been able to walk through this battle. All right, well, back out. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get through it. Yeah, not a, I mean, here, let me see if I can just do one more Hail Mary hit. Yeah, not enough. <laughs> you cheeky son of a gun. As I told you guys, you know, we, we take for granted what Qui-Gon does for the Captain Rex. Otherwise, it's kind of a tough team to beat. Um, I was feeling confident about Dark Trooper Gideon taking it down. I just think, uh, hmm, I think Gideon probably was the better. The double Gideon Scout Trooper felt a little bit better because we would have had turn meter removal, more assisting, a little demoralized baked in there. All right. Keep moving. We, we almost had it. We got close. We got close, but not close enough. All right. I think uh, we're going to probably go down the route of Malikos. Yeah, we don't want to use Revo. We know Captain Rack. I mean, I could probably beat it with... Oh, it looks like they're struggling too. Where are we? Where's the struggles? All right. So they... All right. It looks like they did a Wampa thing there. Oh, wow. That feels bad. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's rough. That's... Oh, boy. I can, I can feel the rage in that one. Ooh. All right. Let's keep moving along. Let's go on. To, um, I think, yeah, let's just, let's throw in Gideon. I don't even know if I want to use Maul here. The second I get dazed, I'm, I'm goofed. But here, I think we should be okay. At least we know what the Kylo's percent uh, health effects don't affect them. Let me double check. Does, is, is, is Malikos mean the health percent effects? Oh gosh, this is too much to read right now. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, All right, too much reading. I'm just going to assume we are, we, yeah. Uh, <laughs> let's just go with it. All right, Malikos, we need some magic cap. I feel like this is probably the, the biggest threatening team we have left on defense. This probably is the best defense we have left. Other, I mean, there's still other good stuff that we have to go through, but I think this is the most complicated one. All right. Both survived the battle. Uh, reading's hard. Read, there's too much reading. I'm hoping this is going to be fine. To them down. I don't know, man. A lot of questionable things going on here. All right, so no days, which is good. Okay. I almost feel like I should just... As long as we have Captain Rex go over there, we should be fine. All right, good hits, good hits. Turn meter. Come on, I can beat freaking Ray with this guy. Big hits, big hit. Rocks! Got some healing immunity. Come on, put him down, put this guy down. Put him down. Put him down. No, 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 no. Come on. Finish it up. Finish it up. Malikos, let's get around this. Oh, get the taunt up. Come on. Come on, Malikos. Get in here. Totally useless. Oh, he's getting away. He's getting away. Oh. Come on. Finish him. There it is. There it is. Rocks. Now we're cooking. Totally useless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. And let's take it to the bank. Let's do some of that. All right. There we go. Saved by the bell. That actually helped me out a little bit. Put him down. There we go. Nice. 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 Okay. I was, I was still, I, I'm going to still stand by everything. I, I felt pretty confident in my decision to do Gideon here. But uh, all right, that's fine. All right. Moving on here. What do we got? It's over. Oof. Okay. Oh gosh, we got we got a lot of work to do still here. How are they doing here? Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. All right, they're going to my Captain Rex battle now. All right, Zori. So I, I'm I'm eyeing her. What do we want to use for Zori? They have no rose. Uh, should we just... I'm leaning towards Afra. I'm leaning towards Afra. Knight. I don't know. Knight says this feel a little risque. Or Starkiller. What are we feeling here? Talzin? You just know how this goes, man. Like, I just... I fear once they roll, they roll, baby. They roll. I, I think I'm going to go with something uh, mildly overkill. I'm going to go Afra here. I think Afra is the better choice. Just to get through it safe, we'll have we'll have other ways using Night Sisters. I think. Yeah, let's just go Afra. We don't want to goof around with Zori. You know how it goes. No Tuskens yet. We already used that on Commander Luke. I actually kind of mildly regret. I feel like that was too easy of a battle. Anyways, Malikos. Thank you so much. If you don't mind, hey, say the line. Say the line. Just say the line. Let's say it. Okay. Okay. I'm not. No, you don't. Uh, you, you missed out on your time. You took too long. 
Afro, baby. Quick, easy wins, baby. Let's go. Three, two, one. Play the song, Gary. Send it. All right, let's go. <sighs> Trying to work through the rest here. We have a Luke we got to worry about. We have a gas we got to worry about. Let's get down to it. Jack up those cooldowns. No data crons here, so no back to back resets. Just go ahead and nuke out Finn. Ending down. All right, keep moving, keep moving. All right, looking good. Give me my friend. All right, friend on the field. Oh gosh, I hate when they do start the roll. All right. All right, let's see if we can do AOEs. Right, some counters coming in. Get those exposes. Oh God, I'm, I'm worried here. Uh, Zori, could, she might bust the move here in a second. Do this. Give me a stun, but it's not gonna matter. There, there goes the cleanse. Oh, this counter attack is kind of annoying me right now. Ugh. As long as Afra sticks on, we should be okay. All right, cool. Retribution's off. Oh, and it's back on. Oh, man, this is not cool right now. Almost down. Come on. <laughs> Every time they get a little turmoil, I get a little worried for myself here. All right, there we go. That should buy me some time. Okay. Whew. All right, breathe. We're going to bounce back from this. All right, do some of this. Okay, you lock him in. Lock in the kill. There it is. All right. I think we got it. Heal up a little bit. Bring a character on the field. Knock her down. All right. Whew. A little scary. I, I, I don't think, I don't know if my knight says would have been able to get through that. Whew. All right. Uh, next up, Generate Luke. What's next here? Uh, I don't have Imperial Troopers. Do we want to just throw Star Killer at this? Or Maul? Hmm. How do we feel about uh, I don't know, any sisters? Don't want to use Darth Revan. That would be. Uh, we don't want to use. I, I'm going to save. You know, maybe we just do this here, and we could use Star Killer on the gas, right? And no, we're going to do Wampa gas, right? Hold on, let me just double check. The gas looks pretty Wampaable. Yeah, I don't think we need to use Reva on the gas, and if anything, we have Star Killer. Um. Yeah, I can maybe do Wampa. All right, I. S Ooh, gotta watch out for the the Seer Junda team. Actually, we gotta be very cautious. Very cautious on that. Inquisitor split. Oh, do we do we feel confident in a S Inquisitor split? That would be very nice if I could do so. Ooh. Okay, Reva without Grand Inquisitor. I've never used Reva without Grand Inquisitor, so I I have hesitations. Where is Inquisitors? All right, Inquisitors. And let's say we go with maybe fifth row, eighth row. You feel good about that? I think we, I think we can make, we can make something work here. Yeah. You feel good? What are you feeling here? What about JKCK? Uh, he's kind of an idiot on defense. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not undermining him, but I'm not like putting too much. I'm not putting too much weight on him. I'm going to go with this. Let's see if we can do a split. That'd be really nice. Let's go. All right. So, I, boy, hope this is going to be okay. Welcome. It's kind of a first, but I think it's good word. Okay. Yeah, we have no ability blocks. Ah. I guess we just want to do the stun, right? Okay. Hoping this is going to be okay. I'm mildly concerned right now. All right, that's a good start. That's good. Can't get stunned. Death mark coming in. I think we got it. I like this. All right, cool. Nice split. We can use Grand Inquisitor somewhere. Would have been nice to use him for like the freaking Qui-Gon battle, but it is what it is. Yeah, we got this. We got this. Lock it in. Lock it in. There it is. All right. Good. Cool. We have an Inquisitor somewhere. I don't know where we're going to use it. Use it here. Why not? All right, there we go. Back to back Inquisitors. Let's make it happen. Inquisitors. This should be a pretty good team. All right. Get in there. Jedi Knight Cal, I, I'll be surprised if Cal can do something here. Okay, what do we want to do here? What's the order of operations? Uh, we got to worry about Mace Windu. Why don't we just lock him in with the days? Okay, give me some more days. Um, give me some ability blocks. There we go. Can ability block Cal? Completely forgot about that. That's actually a good play right there, man. That was literally the best thing he could have done there. Ooh, that was literally the best opening play Cal could have had. Oh, well, it is what it is. Oh, let's just do that. Try to get this window out of commission. Uh, 
man, do I want to use this? This is kind of a waste, right? Yeah, let's get some more purge on him. All right. Oof, Rest. the other point's killing me right now. Man, Cal is playing this. He never plays like this. Maybe it's different. On full auto offense, he does. he's playing this perfectly right now. Normally, he just keeps doing like the same ability over and over again in my experience. All right, well, we're gonna keep moving. And yeah, this window is kind of holding me back for a minute here. Yeah, we we got to get rid of him. Come on. Oh, don't you dare. There we go. Okay. I'm really curious to see if Cal's going to do... Is he going to switch stances again? Or is he going to stay in the same stance? Get those buffs off him for the moment. All right. And... Yeah, just doing her. Okay, come on. Keep moving. You got this. Healing me locked in. Give me some of these buffs. Wow. I've never seen Cal play this perfectly. Never. Usually just like does the same stance over and over again. This is awesome. I wish she would do this all the time. Uh, can I don't know if we're going to be able to kill him off in time here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to kill him off in time. Pull back his terminator a little bit. All right, that's going to buy me some time here. All right. Man, he's a thick boy. Come on. You know, just get that force set off. Pull, do this. There we go. I'm, I'm trying to buy myself as much time as possible. I got to say, beyond impressed. This I've I've only seen Cal on defense a few times, but he almost got the kill on me right there. He almost got him. He played it well because you gave him the knee. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. Yeah. He just, like, usually I... Again, auto offense... Like, Supreme Kyle run auto offense is different than defense. On offense, Kyle is kind of an idiot, too. He doesn't do the right combo. But on defense, he does. Maybe that's kind of what it what it's like here. I we, we fought Cal a few times on defense when he first came out. And I wasn't impressed. I don't know. Maybe something changed, or they just got lucky. That was a little close. That was a little bit close there. I will say I underestimated that a little bit, but I don't know if it was I rightfully underestimated it or they got lucky. Uh, who knows? All right. Fifty-seven banners. Whoo! That was close though. That was close. And Shorty in the club. And the question is, do I want to deal with Wampa here? Uh, do I have anything better? Then using Wampa, we gotta use we gotta use Maul somewhere. So I don't know where we're gonna utilize that. Night Sisters, I think Night Sisters can work here, right? I think Night Sisters can work here. It's been a minute since we used Night Sister against Droids, but I believe we should be okay. I think I might actually throw in Daka just to make sure we have an extra revive. Yeah, let's let's maybe throw in Daka just in case things go a little hairy on me here. Yeah. Then we could try to maybe do Wampa on gas if need be. Where the heck's the Night Sister tag? Right there. There it is. All right. You feeling good about this? No Night Sisters? I mean, uh, it should work. We're going to ignore all the protection on him. Yeah. Nan Nuch used this earlier? Yeah, I think this should be fine. This, is nothing, this isn't anything too revolutionary. All right. Let's get into it. I'm going to go with it. I'm going to, and if it, if it loses, it loses. That's all I can say. Night Sister Spirit? Yeah. 100% use. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. Yeah, we should be good. Unless you just don't want to see the Night Sisters. We got to use them one way or another. Let's just use it now. Get to this uh, back wall. Open it up and keep the chains moving along. All right. Any dissenting opinions? I don't care. We're going to play this. Let's go. Send it. This should be Gooch. Should be Gooch. Should be Gooch. Use Iden. Yeah, we got we to find a home for Iden somewhere, right? Okay. All right. Let them get their first few plays. All right. Uh, save that for now. Got the stun. All right, get me some plagues on the book. All right, just got to watch out. All right, under stealth. I, I just, I know I could probably activate the cheese. I'm just, a, I'm too much of a chicken. Let's go ahead and do some buff the spells here. There we go. All right, let's go work over here. All right, let the plague get the job done. Lock it in, lock it in. All right, that's, sh oh, come on. Give me stun. Nice stuns, good stuns. Yeah, look at this. Yeah, no problem. Don't need to worry about all that protection on Shorty. Keep it moving. Give me a stun. Nah, and she go. Easy money again. Not a doubt on this one. This is this is pretty elementary, my dear Watsons. But a nice sister handle. Crank it up. Let's get to the finish line. Come on, give me some stuns. Stop delaying this. Let's get in there. Come on. Oh my gosh, this is annoying. Oh, all right, let's go. Oh, and of course she's stunned right now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, come on. Basics. Uh, you gotta be kidding me. You know, just hit it with the... 
Oh, come on. What do you mean resist it? Uh, just die. 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 No. Die. Thank you. All right. Yeah, just do basics. Come on. And it's not on a banner. Slightly annoying. Jeez. All right. Cool. Top side locked in. Let's go lock in the south. We have 22 minutes on the clock. I don't know what's going on in my con universe. We'll check back in a little bit. All right. Uh, I actually, I'm actually concerned about this Seer Junda battle. I want to believe Star Killer can handle that. I, I, I mean, it's. Oof. Am I missing something? Let's check out our dark side faction real quick before we commit to anything. All right. Uh, Mandalorians. Basically, our two big teams are Star Killer and Maul. How do we feel about Maul? You think Maul's gonna be okay here? And we have Darth Revan too. Yeah, Darth Revan too. But we could probably use Darth Revan on I don't know, like this. Uh... So I'm thinking Darth Maul. I'm sorry, Darth Maul here, Darth Revan here, Wampa here, hopefully, and then whatever other teams I have left for these these two guys. I think that's. I think we have to make Maul do something big here. And Iden too, yeah. I think there was. Uh, we could maybe do Iden on Dash or something. All right. I'm hoping this is gonna work. Why do I have this? I have this like weird feeling in the back of my head that this is not gonna work. All right, Wampa for gas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the game plan. But I, this is the battle I'm most concerned about here because we don't have Bad Batch to get through this here. All right. We should be fine, right? We should be. We should be Gooch. Everything should be Gooch. What about Darth Revan? We're going to do Darth Revan on the, the Wedge Chewy. That's the game plan. There we go. Let's go. We got to go fast. I need big plays. All right, let's get to it. Okay. Let's get to it. Let's go. Oof. I don't know, man. All right, we got to get Maul moving. Um, let's do that. All right. Choice you have made. Come on, Maul. You, you're making a little progress, but not as much as I was hoping. Come on. Come on. Almost there. Yeah, yeah, we got it. We got it. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. Probably should go for Ahsoka next, honestly. A bit of a misplay. Yeah, I think we got to go Ahsoka next here. Come on. Crank it up. Big play. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. We're good. Okay. Come on. Come on. He's no spin around. There we go. We're making, we're getting there. Too much foresight. Not yet, not yet. Almost there. Ooh, hold on. Ooh, okay, we're okay. We're okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. One more turn. One more turn. We're getting there. There we go. Nice hit. Nice hit. Come on. Presence so close. All right. Come on. We're fine. Kenobi. Let's go, Maul. It's all you. It's all you, baby. Let's go. Kenobi. There we go. Come on. Anything ah! to say. Over here. Like your oh, new legs. Oh, yes. They make you look tall. Oh, come on. No, don't do this to me. No. No. Revenge. 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 Just finish it, baby. Nice. I think that was the best use for Maul. That battle could have been a lot hairier. All right, Darth Revan, let's freaking G. Oh, yo's. All right, Sith Empire, we're going to go you, you, and you. I'm not even going to think twice. Let's get in there. Keep moving. All right, now we just got to hope Wampa. I don't even know. Do I want to risk it? I could probably just. Ooh, I could probably just use Star Killer on the gas. We want to play it super safe here. All right, let's get the Wookiee out. Stun him. Nice stun. Great stuns. Hit him back. There we go. Looking good. Lock it in. Probably could have used Iden here as well, now that I think about it. It's fine. It's all good. We'll, we'll take it. Okay. 56. All right. Uh, okay. Oh. All right, guys. You tell me. Are we doing Wampa? I don't think we need to use Wampa. I think we have the game plan. I think we're going to do... We're going to do probably Iden, Star Killer, and I probably have a team I'm not thinking of right now to handle the Jedi Training Ray. You want to go Wampa? All right, let's do it. It's we're not going to get many opportunities. No Datacrons gas. Let's do. I'm feeling it. Wampa baby, where are you at? 
Where are you at? Where are you at? Come on out. All right. Listen, we got, we, listen, I, I'd be remiss if we didn't take advantage of the opportunity. We're going for fun, not necessarily the win. If we can get both, cool. But you know what? Everyone, I just need you to get your hands together. We need to get Wampa ready to rock and roll. Let's do it, baby. Send it. All right, no Captain Rex. The problem is the raw damage that Wampa is going to need to eat up here. All right. All right. And I don't like that. Okay. This is going to hurt for a little bit. All right, give it a second. Just give me a second. Let me bounce back. All right. We're up and running. Okay, a little sketchy there for a second. Now Wampa's in full swing. We got protection up. We're ready to go. Get this gas down. Not quite there yet. Go, come on. Ramp up. Don't hit him. Knock him down. Good. All right. Arc Trooper. Ah, oh, I needed you dead. All right, let's take our time. I need to get I need to get this bone protection up if we're going to take down this gas. Can we stall this out a little bit? Ooh, I don't know if we're gonna make it. Ugh. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, let's hope for a little bit more time. I don't think we're gonna make it! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Needed that protection up. Ah, we got something at least. Ah, oh, too much damage. Yeah, it took us too long to get that bone protection. And I, I was really trying to take my time when gas got down finally. All right. Ah, oh, it's fine. I think my opponent did the same thing. That's probably why they're, uh, <laughs> but I, at least they got the red. I didn't even get the red. Okay. All right. What are we at here? Uh, we'll come back and clean that up here. I guess we can do star killer. All right. How do we want to do this now? Uh, we can probably do Iden to clean up the gas. Then we can do Star Killer. What was my other thing? What was my other team we said we're gonna use? I forgot already. What was the other team we had? I completely forgot the team. Um, I don't know. Star Killer, Iden, and something else. All right, let's see. What's? Uh, let's just do Star Killer here. This is probably the most threatening team we have left here. Star Killer, out on the field, baby. Let's go. Three, two, one. Send it. Let's go. Keep moving. Keep moving. Come on. Keep moving. All right, let's get down to business. Oh, come on. You got to be kidding me with that one. That's, that's annoying. All right, come on. Get around this. Probably should have done that first. A little misplay. It's fine. All right, let's... Um... Oh, this is going to be... This is going to be slightly annoying, isn't it? It's going to get slightly annoying. Oh, well. We're going to have to eat it up. All right. Come on, get her, get her down, get her down. All right, this is gonna be mildly annoying. We'll be fine. All right, back up. Let's try to get the, oh, come on, get out of here. Just get out, just get out, just get out. Yeah, get out, come on. I definitely should have, uh, my, my whole order is off now. I don't know why I did that first, but oh well. We'll suffer the consequences. All right, there we go. On the Vandy. All right, keep moving. Come on, get a daze. Nice, got locked in. Gone. Nicely done. Pull it out of the sky, 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 sky. Pull it out of the sky, 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 sky. Easy. All right, keep moving, 57. All right, and uh, give me a team. Give me a team. What's what other dark side teams do I have left? I would like to use Iden to get through gas safely. Uh, dark side, dark side, dark side. Uh, hmm. Hux. That's what I was thinking of. Yeah. Hux. Hux on this battle. Yeah. Hux. I forgot about Hux. This should be easy. I don't know. I'll be blown away. Actually, I wouldn't be. I haven't seen this combo in a hot minute. All right. Let's keep going. Yeah. Let's go for it. Send it on in. Hopefully, we can control the Terminator. We just got to remember, we have to do the whole Ray cheese here. So we got to kind of treat this a bit odd. So we got to get Ben down to get uh, 
Boy, why am I... Like, this is, just treat this like a Galactic Legend raid battle, right? Yeah, okay. Now we gotta go for Ben next. There we go. Okay, come on. Now we gotta just do that. That should do it. All right, good enough. Okay, I was hoping to get a two-for-one kill there. Let's finish it up. There we go. Nicely done. Banners, banners, banners. Okay. All right, we got it. Nicely done. Nicely done. All right. It's unfortunate Ben doesn't do as much of Jedi training raids we would like. And then Gas will clean us up with an Iden. Iden, Iden, baby. Da, ba, 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 ba. You, you, and um, we'll go there. All right. Woo! Almost there. Then we'll get the ships, and th today's a first. We're using Leviathan on offense for the first time. I haven't used that on offense a single time. Uh, it's pretty nuts. All right. We have to e do some of this. Okay. Do some of that. There we go. All right. Ships, baby. Ships. All right. 12 minutes on the clock. We got more than enough time to get through ships. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling worried for my opponent, though. Are they going to have enough time? I would love for them to get across the finish line with me. All right. So, Leviathan. Uh, it's pretty wild. I... <laughs> I'll probably be, like, the first one to, to lose this battle here. <laughs> this... If I, I, it's so weird. I n pretty much never use Galactic Legend ships on offense. This is weird. Um, I guess this is all I need. I know it works. I just, <laughs> it just, it feels dirty for me. Uh, I guess we played the song. I never have to play a Revan song on ships. Full auto? Should we full auto? Do you, you guys want to flex? They can full auto. Yeah, I, I know it works. I've done it in like Fleet Arena, but like, I feel like I... We're in Grand Arena. It's like, wait, what am I doing? What are we doing here? Okay. All right. Let them do their opening play. It's fine. Works for me. Works for me. Yeah, you definitely don't want to do Sith Fighter, though, in the starting lot up here. Dorito's the better way of handling profanity here. All right. Getting a turn here. Is it this one? I think it's that ability. That's got the Isolate, right? All right. We got the Isolate. And now all I got to do is focus down on Dash, and we're good to go. All right. Okay. A little bit of protection drops. That's fine. Keep working on that dash rendar. Let's get him nuke to send it. There it is. We got it. We got it. I probably could have undermanned this, if honest. Oh, uh, whatever. Mm, shoot, I guess just do that. Then we'll come in with the instant kill later. Probably should have just left it on in the reinforcements for more banners. All right, Biggie. All right, Biggie's coming out. Come on, don't die. I still need you. I need you still. There we go. Healing up. All right. Do some of this. All right. Good stuff, good stuff. Uh, nah, just keep going on bigs. All right, come on, big hits, big hits, come on. There we go, nice ability block. No, 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 stay strong, stay strong. Okay, keep moving. All uh, right, insta kill. Oh, this feels like a waste. All right, let's bring it up, bring it up. Um, all right, just, all right, just get rid of this, I guess. All right, next up, come on, almost down. That should do it. Good business, good business. Let's keep doing that. Can we try not to get evaded here? Come on, I need good banners here. Good banners, come on. Oh, and there goes my said banners I was asking for. Not quite an ultimate yet. Of course, dodge, what else is new? Oh gosh, there we go, come on. Uh, I'll be honest, I don't remember anything about the Mark <laughs> 6. Uh, it feels so weird doing this, man. Life is so much easier when you do this. There we go. Hitting the ultimate. First time using Leviathan ultimate in Grand Arena. Enjoy the polygons. All right. We have full ownership of both capital ships, but if I'll be honest, this ultimate doesn't really help me out all that much. Uh, let's go. Okay. Let's come on. Let's get across this. D do that, I guess. And send it to... Oh, I should have done the other ability. Uh, oh, well. All right. 75. Holy crap, man. I can't remember the last time I got a 75 banner win. Jeez. Auto wins faster. I am not even going to doubt it. All right. Negotiator. Um, you know, I'm like mildly concerned about using Executor. Should I be concerned about this? I feel like I should be concerned about this. Oh, we can't use light side ships. Oh, no. So no Executor. I guess we go Chimera. Yeah, we can't use uh, Mando. All right, Empire, we have ourselves you, you. I'm just going to, I'm going to just overkill it here. It's you and you and yeah, I'm going to play it safe just in case things go south. All right, man. 75 banners, that feels good. Oh, no, no, you got to play the song. Gotta play, no, Gary, you gotta, no, no, hurry, the battle's, no, Gary. It's not as, in, it's not as intimidating if Thrawn's like 10 seconds late to his song. Play it. Thank you.
All right. All right, what do we want to do here? I guess get Anakin down ASAP. Come on. All right, there we go. Good stuff, good stuff. Give me some dodges. Beautiful dodge. Let's go. Ooh, you know what? I'm doing this first. Okay. Let's lock in more honor. Yeah, get wrecked. Get wrecked. Oh, that's the only downside of killing Anakin too fast. Kenobi gets ticked off. Oh, well. Uh, let's fix you up here. Okay, a little messy opening play. Give me some foresight. Okay. Let's see what we have cooking in the kitchen. Back over here. What do we got here in the reinforcements? Fives, okay. We need to get a... Hmm. I had to do base. Oh, what am I doing? Go for five. Go for five. Let's heal up a little bit. Let's get some buffs on me. There we go. Some buffs. Okay. Don't like that. Ooh. Actually, I regret doing that right there. Come on, keep moving. Almost there. Oh, give me some foresight. Ooh, they're going hard on this guy here. Come on. Almost down. Let's get some buff dispels. We should be able to get tied defender. I'm probably going to try to lock in a stun. Yeah, let's do stun. Stun. Let's get Marauder out of commission here. Nicely done. It's going to miss out on the bonus turn. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Ah, that's fine. Okay, nice dodge. Yeah, come on. There it is. Come on. Clean wins. Clean wins. Let's go. Over here. Some of that. And I, yeah, we're gonna try to get some banners back here in a sec. Oh, never mind. <laughs> 71 and Holdo last on the list here. Do they have comeuppance? I don't know, but I, if they, I hope they do, because this could be a pretty funny battle. Separatist. Uh, what do you want to utilize here? Okay. We got time. We got six minutes. Let's not rush this. Let me think through this for a second. All right. So the good news is they have a full reinforcement slot, and that means if they do have comeuppance. I don't know what the order is for the AI, but I'm hoping the Cuffins does not come out. So I think we should be able to find this. What are Relic 8 Geos? Baby, we made a video just the other day talking about that. Great for profanity. Countering profanity, I should say. Okay, I feel like we're good here, right? Hound's Tooth? Uh, I mean, we could throw it in just in case. I'll bring it in. Yeah, so I guess might as well play it safe. Okay, exec for clean. Uh... All right, we'll save Hound's Tooth then. This usually is more than enough. All right. I, I, I want to see come up and show up to the party. So I'm even though I should be rooting for me to maybe lose, I want to see if the come up will do something on defense. Okay. What do you want to do here? It doesn't really matter all that much, does it? I don't know. Just doesn't really matter. Uh, she's going to clean it up anyways. Probably should just, yeah, whatever. All right. Let him get in here. Okay. Oh, Hondo! Hondo! I wasn't expecting you to get on the call! Alright, Hondo's in the party, y'all. Alright, let's see if we can try to get rid of you. Amazing tank, 10 out of 10, would tank again. Okay. Alright. Um, give me some buzzies. Alright, we got it, we got it, we got it. Alright, that's gonna hurt. Ooh. I'm worried about the come up and showing up here. Alright, let's go. Let's go target you. Oh, we don't have any. Oh, shoot. Come on. All right, come up and. It's the come up and. Oh, we're getting nukes. We're going to get nukes. Holy crap, it came out. Oh, my gosh. We're going to get absolutely wrecked now. We're going to get wreckified here. Check this out. Oh, okay. Well, okay. Ignore that play. We're going to ignore that. I. Wow. The, so. It's like the Cal casting. Will she always come out first? I don't know. Like, if she comes out first reinforcing, that is huge. On offense AI, she was not doing that. All right. That's fine. Let's uh, just, come on, do some basics. Uh, okay, I think they lost their steam. They may have lost steam. I don't know. They're not out of it yet. I mean, we're going to lose some people still. Oh, see, look at it. There we go. Look at that. Okay. Uh, there was a world where that could have been a much different battle. Hmm. Oh man, they they had a, they had a chance. They had a chance to really wreck me. I barely got out of this alive. All right. Um. Hey, I can safely say if that's always gonna happen. It's just, I think it's it's just the fact that Holdo is going to be a better fleet. If, if it's always going to bring comeuppance out first, and they had four reinforcements. 
If they're always going to bring our comeuppance first, this is a much better flea, but I just don't know. Aldo survives every time. Yeah, the buzz droids definitely saved my butt. All right, let's clap my kind of cross the finish line here. Man, I, uh, ton of fun. Ton of fun. Come on, Micah, let's get across the line. They may have actually won. I don't know if they dropped nearly as much as me. I feel like we dropped... <laughs> I think uh, we dropped the trench battle, of course. We dropped the, uh, the gas battle. Um, and we dropped the Captain Rex, but I think he's got it. It's all his, yeah, he's got the win. Come on, let's get across the finish line, Mikon. You got, yeah, if he has Hux, this should be an easy battle. Two minutes, they got more than enough time to get through it. Woo! This was fun. This was a ton of fun. Man, I wish we had more opportunities to do this. So that's why I appreciate Mikon coming out, mixing things up. I think it's for the benefit of both of us. Make it's just like it's it's nice as getting out of that normal grand arena grind having a good time oh come on mike and you got the you got you got the four, 54 seconds come on don't tell me you're gonna time out let's get it go oh hondo no <laughs> i guess there's a reason why he hopped on the airwave there a moment ago oh no come on mike oh will he have enough time to get across the line oh come on bud 32 seconds. Oh, that's 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 a tight deadline. That's a tight deadline to squeeze in. Um, not a light side. No, no. So we agreed that Hondo could be used on offense or defense because he's neutral. So you can put him on defense of light side or offense. We 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 talked about that before. So uh that was a mutually agreed upon things. Like, what do we do with Hondo? I don't know. Use him wherever. I like that though. You know, it gives you the flexibility. Like <laughs> he's neutral. I feel like CG's not even utilizing enough. Oh, come on, dude. I'm gonna feel so bad if he gets stuck behind. Oh no, five. Four, three, oh, I don't know where the four went. Two, one. Oh. Did he get it though? Did he get through? Oh, buddy. Oh, oh no. I think he would have. Oh. I think he was going to win that too. Oh, man, I feel bad now. Hopefully, my. I don't know if Mikeon's in the chat. Uh, I hope he had as much fun as I did. Man, that's how you start 3v3. As I said, not everyone likes 3v3, but man, if we had 3v3s like this all the time. Oh. Oh, Grander is just so much more fun when you do these experimental things. Uh, I think he would have had this. Uh, 17, 19, minus. Yeah, all he had to do was all he had to do was full clear. Oh man. How funny was that? Because we were discussing uh it's like, oh, what do we do with Honda? I'm like, oh, do whatever you want with him. So funny enough, that one thing we discussed, I guess, uh <laughs> stopped him from getting across. Wow. Is Mike on here? I he I know he watches. He was excited. Hopefully him and his children were here. Uh Mike has to go to assist the Kyber Emperor. Yeah, he, that, again, not many people are willing to goof around, possibly lose a grand arena, you know, and all this other stuff. Like they've worked so hard on Data Crons and Galactic Labs. They want to use them, but again, that's fine. Tweets their own. So I really appreciate Mike on. One more round of applause here, man. Really appreciate Mike on going up off the hamster wheel with me, goofing around a little bit. Uh, he did very well. He did very well. I think he only dropped the gas battle. Yeah, I think, yes, I think he probably did the same thing, tried to wampa his way through uh north side did we get any holds up here yeah he, he did very well the the win was his i guess honda was just giving us the heads up he's here to lock in some wins yeah ships mm, looks like we had the same idea so what i said so here's what i did i was worried that radis holdo wasn't going to bring out come up and so i kept it to a one reinforcement lineup so if you guys happen to see these holdos on defense and you fight the comeuppance let me know maybe the ai's got some consistency with constantly bring her out guaranteed first reinforcement then i'd want to have the other slots filled up maybe we got to put this in my fleet arena and ask my excuse me fleet arena shards to come uh to come fight it so uh interesting there yeah so it really just came down i guess it was just uh just hondo right yeah it was just <laughs> god that's hilarious here <laughs> oh no mike are you that guy you ran out of time yeah we were watching i mean we we're rooting for you we thought you're gonna get the win and hondo man oh my gosh Oh, means a lot, Mike. Hopefully meet again. I would love to do this again with you. If, uh, if I see your name, I'm going to keep an eye. I would love to, to try something out with you. Uh, mix it up. And it looks like we even got the win on the free-to-play first Kyber win. I'm guessing our Jabba just held him back. I'm guessing he had Jabba. Uh, I, I, yeah, as we went through the roster, I don't think they had a Jabba solution. Even if they got through my executor, which they probably could have, I don't think they had the win. They had to get the executor and java so there we go let i'm gonna take a peek at my next opponent though uh real quick here is this gonna be another fair matchup let's see um uh, okay all right maybe maybe i just got lucky yeah because this is a little bit more what we're used to one two three four you know so they have double the gls and okay 
I was feeling a bit optimistic that maybe like the matchmaking got fixed and we're gonna have like closer matchups here. Uh, let me check out the other ones. How are we doing, Kylo? You have to go poo poo. Oh, uh, you gotta go poo poo. 6.9. Wow, that is a very lean 6.9. Wow, we have. Dang, that's crazy. That's that. That's this is a good roster right here. Yeah. The boy, that's a good one. That's a good one there. So I have a feeling that guy's probably gonna climb up a little bit. Um. Like, see, this is kind of reasonable. It's kind of like our opponent we had today. Like, see, this I, I feel pretty competitive up against. I don't know. Maybe maybe there's something going on. I mean, they're not all perfect. You, you can't expect that for all of them. But you know what? Mm, check this one. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I just got lucky and I had a decent match up there. <laughs> is Mike on, still in the chat? I don't know if he's here still. But uh, again, thank you so much for the... The love and time and goofing around. Hopefully your kids had a good time with us as well today. Oh, man. All right. Let's do a little chilling session here real quick uh, while we catch up with all y'all people that were patient enough to wait with me as we got through that grand rate. You know, I, like I have this weird clock in my head. I know when like I'm running out of time. If I would just read one or two more comments like, oh, that's all the time that I, uh, that I, that I needed. I can go to the wayside. Why do you still have Clone Sergeant Icon the free to play? Because I think it's funny. And my sense of humor is pretty lame. That's why. Uh, Reginald Brown, five gifted memberships. Thank you. Woo. Thank you so much for the generosity. Is there any like a galactic challenge or something we could throw on in the background? Uh, let me see. There's got to be something cooking here, right? Um, nothing. Nothing going on here. Oh man. Uh, we got a territory wars. Oh, conquest. There we go. So let's do a quick conquest update before we do our little chill sesh. About to get gold crate again. I actually feel like I'm having an easier time this time. Well, it helps out I have Jabba. Jabba really is awesome for Conquest. Once you throw out those thermal detonators, game over. So all I got to do is I basically got to get a couple more, uh, a couple more of the staggers locked in on this one. I feel like I'm doing this inefficiently, by the way. Like, there's probably a faster way, but uh, you know, I'll get to, I'll get there when I get there. All right, let's go throw some of this on auto and have a good time. Shout out to Mike on. He's in my alliance. Awesome, fun to watch. Yeah. Nah. So like, I don't know how you guys feel. I, and I know some people, they love Data Crumbs. Like it's the best thing ever, you know, more power to you. But like, this is I, like today, I, I felt that like original Grand Arena magic, you know, having a good time, no Data Crumbs, no Galactic. I mean, I don't got that much beef against Galactic Legends. So I'm not like beefing against them, but like, it just, it feels, it feels natural. It's like the way the game mode is meant to be played. It's just, uh, it feels good, man. It feels good. And I really appreciate having these rare moments to do this. Ah, all right. What do we got here? CK Nugget, two dollars. Missed my uh, super chat this beginning of the stream. Yeah, we're gonna catch up now. Thanks for your patience. I appreciate it. All right. Uh, so again, it's probably all the amplify agony. It's like ruining this, but yeah, you know, I'll get there when I get there. There we go. Just throw that out there. All right. Let me go back to where I left off, and we'll work my way down. We talked to Yana. We talked to Fet Boba. We talked to Fitty. And here, CK Nugget. I think you were the last person I was leaving off with. CK Nugget from a while ago. The twenty dollars. Max out my crate and conquest a couple days ago, even though it's normal node. Still doesn't hurt to get some shards for Bane and Gideon. Hey, no, it doesn't hurt at all. Every little bit helps out tremendously. Oh, god dang, dude. Holy cow. Kyle, I'm telling you, he's a Sith Lord, man. Every time I touch him, I'm getting shocked up the wazoo here. Oh my god, I'm still getting like it, he's not even by me, and I'm still like shocked at everything. Um, uh, quickly finishing up my SO care and soon getting back to the grind for Grand Inquisitor. Wow, okay. Yeah, I'm hoping you have, if you, do you have Reva, if you have Reva, yeah, you better be banking on that Grand Inquisitor. Eh, life gets a little bit more interesting once you get it. Or maybe you got that scythe. Nonetheless, CK Nugget, thank you for your patience, your generosity, and sharing the good news that you got, my friend. Ah, oh, next up here, we have Big List, seven months. CG, fix your matchmaking! I got mildly optimistic that maybe it was like getting fixed, but I don't think it really was... Listen, let's just enjoy the fact that we had kind of a normal Grand Arena match in my free to play today. And then we have Kamiks, aka Neo! 21 months, you think Bane will end up wanting health or offense focused modding? Excited for the stream. Oh man. Uh, I, uh, from the initial thoughts that I've gathered and others, it doesn't seem like it's too far fetched to assume. Uh, I want to fix up my hell on. Do we, let me see. I'll, I'll, I'll maybe pick up a. Uh, that's uh, a small stim pack. Uh, the assumption seems to be health, right? Because he's going to do damage based off his max health, and there's going to be so many ways to abuse his max health and make it even higher through datacrons, modding, 
uh, abilities out there, unique abilities and whatnot. So uh, that's, I feel like that's what the common denominator is. You know, we we'll have to wait and see, though. You know, once we once we finally let the the rubber meet the road in a couple weeks here, about a, I think in what in about a month, right? Because conquest ends on Monday, and then you get a week break, and then it starts up. Yes, I think we're gonna have first Monday in March. We'll unlock him. Vet Han stagger and basically, yeah. But the problem is, if I don't use Han, I'm gonna get like absolutely ran over. <laughs> That's the issue. So I use Han Solo. I. I stop him from uh, going, give Palpatine a turn meter train, and, uh, and then we start going on. Um, yeah, that's the, that's the issue. I don't really... Maybe there's like a data data discs combo or something. I mean, I'll get there when I get there. You know, I'm going to get there probably by tomorrow. You know, so it's not like I'm in a in a super duper rush. Otherwise, yeah, actually, I'm probably got more stuff to do on my main account than here. Yeah, all I got to do is the stagger. Yeah, I'm already out of energy. I already did some of my stuff earlier today. Let's go hop over to the main account. Ah. Uh, He's ever been our previous message. Yeah, I'm, I'm catching up. I'm catching up here. Don't worry. I'm catching up. Listen, I'm not. Listen, you know me. I'm not going anywhere until I've made sure I, I, I hung out with all you guys and I saw everything you guys threw down. Uh, otherwise, I feel so bad about myself for not being able to keep up. All right, we have Kamik's AKD. We have Yotter. I put one of my friends on your playlist. Peep the DMs. All right, so Yotter asked me to look at his DMs. Uh, Yotter. <laughs> oh that's awesome it really means a lot uh that uh people you know again the, the music stuff's just like pure passion side project and it means a lot that people enjoy it so here's yotter's friend had him sl listen to some of our bangers <laughs> hey bro don't forget to peep that star wars place i sent you a few weeks ago oh bat bro wtf is this dead face dead face i'm effing with long live the empire Oh, I love it. Uh, it really means a lot. Thanks for sharing the, the love, Yotter. Uh, you know, it means a lot. You know, again, we, we, we like to kind of step outside the box, do some interesting stuff, and you guys being there to support it really, really is amazing. Ah, oh, let's keep it going. He's starting to believe. I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, we got Fed Boba. We have Michael Yench. The long live the Jedi. Jedi, Jedi, Jedi. I feel like the Jedi did okay today. And no, I decimated the Jedi. Yeah, I think I decimated all the Jedi today. So they didn't, they didn't really live long in my grand arenas hold on let me see uh what are we missing out isn't it funny i'm actually at a higher crate on my free to play account than this because everyone's got to basically focus on getting their data crowns in sector four and then once grand arena and territory starts then i go back and finish things up what do we let me find a sector where i can just i think there's like a tuscan node i can just turn off my brain and use tuscans on auto right tuscans auto uh yeah cool we can do tuscans here all right let's go drop some tuscans full auto so i don't need to pay attention to conquest all right what do we got do, 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 do. tuskins get out baby get out where you went do, 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 do. okay there we go all right where do i live where do i leave off here mm -mm 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 -mm. we have a uh, alpaca seth with the nine months lost my jc against a 10 million account by seven banners Oof, that's a little painful that is a little oh shoot i forgot i gotta put my data disc back on oh no Oh, I, I was doing the piet cheese. That's what I was doing last time. Ah, oh, shoot. All right, well, hopefully they get through it still. They'll figure it out. That's a, that's a rough feeling. Hey, in your heart, you know you could have won, Alpaca. That's all that matters. You'll get them next time. Don't you worry about it. Then we have Mischievous Grievous. Four, nine, 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 nine trillion pounds. My God. What do you think about the about an MTT Naboo raid with Rise of the Empire Naboo Planet? MTT. What does MTT stand for? Uh, about an MTT Naboo raid. MTT Mass Transformers Tuesday? That, that doesn't. That, man, is, is, I don't think it's got anything to do with the Transformers. Robots in disguise. It's the droid thingy. MTT. MTT. Oh, the transport. Oh, said, yeah. I don't know the abbreviation. I know multi troop transport, though. Okay. Um, hmm. I don't know. I mean, I, I, listen, I'm not opposed to it. If that's true, I'm trying to get out of me. I think that'd be pretty cool. So like just constant waves of droids coming out. Um, I would need a little bit more like, uh, like I'm trying to, I, have to, I, I probably have to rewatch. It was just B1 battle droids, just constant waves of B1 battle droids. I don't know if that would have been like. Like for me here, just this is just me. When it comes to raids, I really, really like 
epic bosses like crate dragon raid awesome sith trio awesome rancor awesome the aat raid was interesting because it had different waves of different uh enemies that are coming at you so if they could do something like the aat raid but we know they don't do multi-phase raids anymore that's the impression i'm getting um hmm it would have to depend how it goes down otherwise i feel like there's more big thematic boss type raids yeah your data scan yeah, i mean hey they're, they're making it work i'd rather not waste the energy if they're doing okay yeah if they're winning i'm not gonna I'm not gonna bother uh, but now they're kind of getting their butts kicked so maybe i gotta put the other data back on here uh, yeah whatever they'll figure it out ah uh, all right what do we got here oops yeah uh, okay yeah because I, I had to redo my data because i was having a hard time cheesing of piet so i put on the v voluntary vanguard and all that jazz uh yeah if they win i won't bother tuscan chieftain <laughs> proceeds to die <laughs> anyways uh what was the rest of your comment gungan facts oh yeah I, I i listen i will like i will be surprised if there is no gungan faction this year. i i feel like with the phantom menace anniversary i would be beyond surprised if it doesn't happen so i'm hoping it happens and jedi fleet for older public hmm lltke 25 i don't know if there's gonna be an older public fleet this year it'd feel weird having two back-to-back older public fleets I, I i really want to believe it's either going to be trench i feel like that's where my money is at um some people said there's no way they do back-to-back -back dark side capital ships why not why not just because there's a pattern doesn't mean the pattern is always going to be that way you know it's like we had a pattern of two galactic legends and it was just one and you know and they, the, they had two dark side galactic legends back to back right one from lord vader to jabba so that's where my money is at. Some people are maybe hoping for, like, maybe it could be a Galactic Republic capital ship with the whole Bad Batch Marauder. Uh, you know, time will tell. Uh, listen, if it's Star Wars, I'm down, baby. I am down, down, down. Uh, we have Dr. H13, 41 months. My, my, my. That's a long, long time right there. Uh, afternoon, Idol. How's it going? I'm having a fantastic day, and hopefully you are too, bud. Thank you so much for the 41 months of the Cobra Club VIP Plus program. Hopefully you're able to keep the little Darth Bane teaser the other day in your kyber Cove vip plus uh, subscription feed and then we have rio five pounds arnold sorry i messaged an insta don't worry i don't use instagram really <laughs> but i thought you might like a metal star wars song i sent you LLTKE, and it's great to be in the empire today what's you should have let the name of it here so i could have checked it out yeah i don't yeah i don't really use instagram i don't really use much social media i feel like the less social media the better you know I, otherwise i'll be like my brother he's uh i love him man he's like on TikTok all day then the instagram and then the twitter it's like how do you get anything done so at some point uh like twitter is like the only i'm sorry x like that's the one thing i'll hop on once in a while to let my brain rot a little bit otherwise uh, uh i try to minimal minimize my social media although i wish I, I used instagram more it'd be fun it'd be fun i think um but if you tell me the name i'll check it out i don't know if i can listen to it on stream because sometimes not everyone's you know kosher with you know playing their music on stream that's fine you know i don't want to I don't want them getting mad at me or listen to their song or whatever on stream twitter see that i'm sorry yeah the x the x the x factor i'm telling you man missed opportunity for elon musk to buy x videos i'm telling you uh, he, I'm he's probably thought of it at least once what else we got here we have it's a mystery 16 months llteke love to see these fun jc's best content same here buddy uh eddie again if i if someone gives me the opportunity i would do it for a whole season just constantly mixing things up i i could be wrong but i feel like more people would enjoy that over you know the usual data crunch shenanigans the only bad thing about it is that the longer we delay playing grander than normally the less practice i get with the data crowns like i have absolutely no practice with this current season of data crowns on defense so <laughs> that's the only downside of goofing around a little bit uh what else we got here we have a uh, iso the 50 months oh i think i already got you but nonetheless thank you and then we have megan mary uh boiler thank you for the five gifted memberships to the carbon club vip yeah, plus program man I, I love when people do the little gifted membership thing you're sharing that love all around town baby thank you megan hopefully all is well in your part of the galaxy and then we talked to grandmaster veers again thank you mike on for all the fun we had today and then we have uh henry nelson five dollars watcher since 2019 oh we talked about that congrats on your SOKR. then we have jack let's keep moving our tuscan love keep moving they're, they're doing all right don't need it yeah i'm not going to change the data unless the team just like starts to flat out lose you know i don't want to i because i'm going to end up if the tuscans start losing i'm just going to go back doing my 
Admiral Piet cheese. Uh, where was I at? Hold on. Jack, 10 cheers for any opponent who has, uh, for having some oddball fun in JC. I already got you. I echo that sentiment just like you. And then we have Steve-O, 34 months, LLTE. Sorry I'm late. You may begin. Listen, the party don't stop until Steve-O walks in, honey. Whoo! Great seeing you, bud. Hopefully you had some fun. And then uh, we already got Ryo there. Yeah, if you could tell me the name of the song, Ryo, I'll, I'll look it up and bookmark it for later. Unless, like, they're cool with me, like, reacting to it on stream. But I don't know if they are or not. Ah, uh, what else we got here? We have ourselves... We have all the 18 months, Trench Relic 9. What have I missed? Oh, man. Just go back a cup. Go in the live stream folder on my channel. You'll see it. You'll see the Relic 9 Trench. I'll give you the quick cliff notes. Basically, I misplayed so terribly against Trench. I lost my first Trench battle of like all time in Grand Arena. And I was like, you know, we got to remember this day. The day when I finally lost the Trench. My first battle ever. So I think it was, I think it was pretty fitting. It's also a pretty big IQ if you think about it. Because we're like several steps ahead. I'm, if there's a Trench Capital ship... I'm ready. I ripped off the Band-Aid. Otherwise, yeah, it's a pretty, pretty crappy Relic 9 to have. But anyway, uh, we have Mark Mate permanently trench from your roster at this point. Listen, I keep trying. I want to love the guy. I just, uh, it's hard to love something that doesn't want to be loved, if that makes any sense. Do you think we'll ever see a double pilot capital ship trench newt pilots? Ooh, that would, uh, hmm. I can't, I mean, why would I say no? I mean, uh. I'll just say uh, it depends on the pilots. Watch, they're going to like make Malikos and like, uh, I don't know, like Maul a pilot. <laughs> just two Conquest characters. Relic 9 minimum required to make them work. I don't know. I, I You know, we've gotten used to a system, but just because it's been that way doesn't mean it's always going to be that way. So I, I, I wouldn't put money down on a double pilot capital ship because usually there's only... You got just the one guy at the helm of the ship. But, you know, they do have their second in command, potentially. I, I wouldn't put much money on it. If I had to put money on something Galaxy, that wouldn't be it, though. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, fat leg, did I get you? Five dollars. Finally got to use Trey and Nile Savage against Third Sister. What a dominant counter. Yeah, that's... If it wasn't for Trey, who Reeve would be a little bit trickier on defense. The hand, although Captain Rex kind of has a nice hold on the, the Reva situation, but it, it's a softish counter. But yeah, Treya, it's pretty much Trey is the reason why we don't see Reva on defense. That's pretty much the, the main reason. Otherwise, not many ways can beat her. Uh, then we got Vyadr. What if we get Geo, Geo, and Malakos to the lifter? Oh, man. But you're, now you're speaking my lingo, Yadr. G Galactic Legend. I still have a hard time believing. Like, I want to believe it's just an ultimate troll because not many people are reading the, the High Republic books. There's no way they have a sentient rock. I, I, I just, I gotta watch this, man. I, I, I gotta, I, you know, I'm sure there's gonna be like a full video on this. I'm probably gonna fully educate myself. Geode is peak fiction. I'm, I'm just gonna put it out there because people never seem to know this. And I don't blame you. Geode, Star Wars. I will just say this. I will feel very incomplete if Galaxy Severa shuts down and we never get this right here right here i'm gonna edumacate you guys look at this baby cool look at this character so like I, 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 I there's no like live action appearance is is geo does he move at all like how does he move is is it like is it like the spongebob thing where the rock can move by itself? I, I need i have so many questions and not enough answers geo was a vincent male who acted as the navig i just I just wish I was there in the boardroom when they were ideating the story. They're like, man, we need, we, we need some quality characters. People want to see new, unique Star Wars characters. What can we give them? And someone's like, what about a big chunk of rock? That's, uh... <laughs> I got so many questions, and I love that I have so many questions about this matter. He resembled a tall, dark gray, flinty, flaky rock. According to Gyasi, Geode's true name could only be pronounced by those without a mouth. The vessel was transporting Jedi to Starlight Beacon for its dedication. When the hyperspace... Okay, can you guys stop freaking letting Daka revive? Holy crap Get Get Oh my gosh. All right, well, my Tuscans are struggling now. I just, I still have a hard time believing this. Like, look at this. Look at this lore. Look at all, look at all the books. Is there like, is there a spoiler? Does he die? Does he like... 
end up in like a quarry and they accidentally like break into pieces or something. All right, hold on. Twenty two thirty BBY Geode and the rest of the vessel crew picked up Jarini and follow and fellow Jedi Elzar, man, whom she had been helping in his struggle against the dark side of the force. For transport to Starlight Beacon, man at first assumed Geo was. Oh well, yeah, screw you, man! How dare you assume Geo was simply a rock with a lifelike presence in the force, making him assume it was a sacred plinth of some kind. <laughs> and her, this just sounds like something Robot Chicken would do. And her made confused after Jarini explained Geo was a living being, assuming she was testing him. It was only when Geo was suddenly a meter behind him. As he stood outside the vest, that man realized. I just, I refuse to believe this is real. <laughs> it's not a boulder. It's a rock. Right, Kyla? It's a rock. It's a rock, Kyla. It's not just a... I know you like the rocks. They like going to the rock. You like going to the rock? Yeah, I know you like rock climbing. I know. I know, Kyla. You're a good boy. You know that? Anyways, uh, I... I just hope, you know, th there will be a day when the doors close up shop for Galaxy of Heroes. It'll happen one day. Who knows? 50 years tomorrow. Time will tell. But I just feel like it would be the biggest missed opportunity if they never added Geo to Galaxy of Heroes. Um, I like I, I would rather have Geo than Jedi and Luke Skywalker. That's my hot take. I'm not even I'm not even ashamed to admit it. That's just literally my opinion on the matter there. Uh, anyways, moving on. <sighs> Rossi with two dollars. Malakos would use Geo <laughs> as the one shot. Picks up Geo. Come, kill me if you dare. <laughs> just... Oh man, that would be the greatest combo. Oh, I don't know why I'm oddly excited for a Geo. I don't know nothing about this guy, but I just want to see like what would the kit be? What would the kit like? What does he do? We need to create a, someone's got to create a fan kit for Geode. <laughs> uh, I, I would pay a thousand dollars. No, I'd pay $10,000 for a Geode unlock. Like, you know, you can't get Geode unless you drop some big boy bucks. I'll do it. Uh, fat leg. Anyways, uh, we got you. We got Yotter. Thank you for getting me on a tangent, Yotter. We have Star Empire. Thank you for the 99 cents. Appreciate it, my friend. We have Matthew Hughes. Oh, where'd you go? Oh, you just flew down. Where'd you go, Matthew? There you are. 22 months for Matthew Hughes. Hey, G was charge of music at my friend's wedding. Let's just say Hondo was never found the party. He couldn't crash and smuggle the other KC bangers. And listen, when Hondo shows up, hello, my very good friends. You know, you got a good night ahead of you there. Glad to hear you got the party banging, my friend. Getting Hondo on the line, a couple of the bangers. They're going to be like, bro, what is this music, man? And you're going to be like, it's art in the finest form. I'm just saying, I'm, I'm waiting for uh, Post Malone, Taylor Swift to just slide into DMs. They're like, bro, we got we to make some bangers. I'm like, I'll think about it. We'll see. I don't want to get too far ahead of myself there. I, I don't want to commit if I can't make it happen. Oh, uh, then as, as we have Reginald Brown, five gifted membership. All right, looks like we're running out of Tuscan Steam. All right, uh, it'd be a lot easier if I had the right data disks on. But the reason why I have these data disks is because I was doing a little bit of Admiral Pietchi's in Sector 2. So this was not the day this said I was using the, the clear through all the sectors. But we are trying to get my... Hold on. Uh, you, you. There we go. Trying to get a little of uh, Admiral Pietchi's going here. Ah. Where did I leave off here? Reginald Brown, thank you for the five gifted memberships. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We got the CK Nugget. Thank you for your patience. Uh, hold on, let me make sure I set these guys up. Let me set them up real quick. Uh, let's do this first. All right. Okay, let's get this base out of here. He just ruins my life. Okay. Okay, there we go. All right, let's set us up now. Let's go drop this over here. Okay. There we go. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. This is such an annoying cheese to set up sometimes, man. Okay, come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Okay, just get the base out of here. All right. Let's get set up. 
Come on. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Right here. There we go. Okay. Cheese is set up. Hold on. Let's make sure we get... Okay. Finish him up. There we go. Okay. All right. And now we just hit auto basic and hope we get enough cheese. There we go. All right. They're off to the races there. Just a message. Don't worry, Rex. Listen, Rex. When I'm still streaming, that means nobody's been missed. I'm still scrolling down and hope I didn't like miss you, miss you. And I'm just like still behind, but we're catching up. Uh, well, anyways, where was I? We got Manti Hughes. We got Reginald Brown. We got CK Nugget. Casey McConnell. I think I got you. Yes, we got you, Casey. Thanks again. We have Rampon. Close to 530. First time ever. Love the guides. Close to 530. Close to 530. Brown pop, I hate to say, I, my, my brain just like turned off there. Close to 530. 530. Are you talking speed? Are you talking, I think you're talking, are you talking speed on your Supreme Kyle Ren? I don't know. The five, oh, 500, okay. I'm like 530 what? That, 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 that clarifies it. Nice. 530 first time ever on Conquest. Love the guys. Glad it was helpful. I, um... I'm glad this feels, you know, yeah, there's some chory stuff, but it feels pretty manageable to take this on. I'm glad you're getting some good success here. I wish this was a 10-minute battle. I feel like we're, we need a bit more time. Oh, come on. Malik, come on, bro. Why are you stealing my kills here? <laughs> come on. Come on. Oh, come, no. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. What are you guys doing? Come on. All right. Let me, let me step in here for a second. Oh, you, you got it. Okay. Let's go ahead. You know what? Just give me some fear. There we go. Oh, shoot. That was a buff this spell. All right. Well, I screwed that up. Oh, well. We'll, uh. Yeah, I goofed that up pretty bad, didn't I? <laughs> oh, well, let's go. Come on. No, Mal. No, no, no. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't kill him. That's my kill. Get him out. All right, well, don't do what I did there. <laughs> All right, anyways, where I leave off. We are Swooshy. Long live the Empire. Thank you for the enthusiasm. Thank you for the love. Take my air horn as a sign of gratitude. How many more freaking Piet kills do I got to get? Okay, well, I guess I can't even check there. Oh. I'll right, we'll check in a sec. I'm, I, think I, I think I'm, like, close. I think I only need, like, 20 more. All right, uh, Mike, 17 months. What would you like Star Wars? What would you like? What would you like a Star Wars What If series? Aren't they talking about them? Would I like it? Yeah, I would definitely like it. LLTK, 17 months. Thank you for the 17 months. I'm pretty sure I can. Don't take me. I, I, I'm not really always following every rumor of the Star Wars mill in general. I feel like most of them are just fake news. They could be real. I don't know. I take. I usually take announcements with like movies and TV shows. Like like teaser or alleged rumors with a grain of salt. Um, at least in Galaxy, I kind of have like people. I'm like, yeah, is this legit? It's like, eh, yeah, no. It's like, eh, and you kind of have a hunch. In Star Wars, everyone says one thing. You know, like people are telling me the Ray movie is gonna get canceled. I find that I find that very hard uh, to believe. Anyways, I would love to see a what if says what fifty seven. That makes no sense because I already accomplished what the heck? Because I just what did I only get seven kills of Piet? Because I did this, this I started this from scratch with P Admiral Piet. And I accomplished that like several battles off stream. I have no idea what's going on there. All right, well, I'm going to just Conquest Crash, but I think I, I think it processed the win because I got the rewards. I don't know. Uh, just keep doing our thing, I guess. 57. All right, I'm going to keep track. A rough track. I don't know, it feels weird. So I already got the 50 kills in Sector 2 like a while ago with Admiral Piet and them. All right, well whatever yeah but i would like to see a what if series i think it'd be fun it would be interesting to if they you know they do the stories right or whatever like i would love to see you know like, oh no don't do this to me don't do this to me i would love to see um i mean i know there's like you know fanfics out there and whatnot on this matter but i, I think it'd be kind of fun to see like what would happen oh, okay don't do this to me come on. don't do this to me hold on hold on oh my gosh please don't make my pet die or my veers die god dang man i hate this Stupid feet. Uh, all right, we'll just take if you can get any kills. Uh, hold on. God, this thing is so annoying to set up. Like, I swear to goodness, last conquest, I had such an easier time setting this up. 
I think I should do the dash run. I, I did a, uh, whatever. This, this, uh, okay. You know what? Screw you guys. I'm just going to back out. I don't want to see you guys. I'll be back in a second. Let me try this again. Uh, the fresh start. Freaking rebels, man. They're just. Bay's the annoying one, man. He's just. Uh, I don't know. I'll try it again. The market's easier that way. Oh, I usually mark him. Uh, okay. Fine. Let's no mark. No mark. Just no mark. Okay. Just no mark. I, I did it last round and it was perfectly fine. You know, so it's not like it doesn't work. It does work. But these guys are just being a bunch of jerks right now. All right. Let's get Baze out first. And then let's get it set up. Come on. Yes, let's go. Come on. Yeah, yes. Screw you, Baze. Yeah, lock that in. Okay, come on. No, just come on. Get him out. Come on. Ooh, ooh. Oh, no, no, no. Come on. Ooh. Oh, come on. Ugh. Come on. Just go. Come on. Ugh. 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 I feel like this would be so much easier with just another. If, oh, come, yeah, get out of here. Good. All right. Start. And we'll probably, let's actually. Uh, all right, just, we were already committed to. Okay. So let's try again here. Okay, let's get the kill. There we go. One. I feel like if, he, if he's marked, he assists more, doesn't he? That's why I, I like marking him down. There we go. Okay, let's go over here. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. Oh, come on. This is just frustrating to set up. Maybe I only did get seven kills last time. And I'm just gonna do a full trooper team because I, I just feel like my train takes so long to get set up here. There we go. Oh no, you're not still. No, no, no. Don't you dare steal that kill. How is Malik getting? Like, if seeing Malik get this many turns. Okay. Uh, oh, 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 yeah, I'm getting ticked off too, Kylo. We're doing a full trooper team. This is just so annoying to set up with just these few. Come on, just ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on, no, no. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not gonna get any kills. I'm spending three minutes setting this up. This is why I do conquest Oster. You guys don't want us to be play conquest. Especially when I get to these like later grindy feet. I'm surprised Gary hasn't sued me yet. Let's just say that. Uh I've we've had to get a couple armor replacements. I just throw my tablet at him constantly. There we go. Uh, there we go. I was gonna say. All right, let's go over here. Let's go. Here we go. Come on, keep it going. Now we're gone. All right, there we go. Oh. <sighs> come on. Dude, bro, bro, come on. What are you guys? Okay, come on, guys. Why are you doing? You're just like sitting here. And of course, I didn't even get the kill there. All right, yeah, okay, let's go. Come on. Come on. There we go. What? Oh, see, like I say, I think I need to, if he's marked, this is so much easier if they're marked. Yeah, I, I, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I'm just marking him. I don't care if he dies. Just let him die. Just let him die. Just let him die. Let him shrivel up and die. All right, come on. There we go. We got some fear. There we go. Get some more fear. Oh, of course, we got these now. Oh, I'm sorry. Like, I, I, I want to rage quit out of this battle. It's like we got, we at least got like one kill. So might as well take that with me to the bank. Hey. This is the worst. Jeez. Uh, it, it can just put it off. I don't, I don't want to. I don't want to look at this right now. Uh, all right. Just, just, just die. Just die already. Come on. Let's just go. Come on. Come on, just no, just get in there. Anyways, we need an Arnold T karaoke now. I feel like we need that. Yeah, I, I agree. Because I'm getting really annoyed of Conquest right now. Uh, let's do it. Let's karaoke time. We both survived the purge. My troops betrayed me. Forced to strike them down. And I escaped. This 
that sort of place. The darkness here. It almost took me. But I conquered it. Come! Kill me if you dare! Best part's coming up here. Get ready for it. Break it up. Probably got like one kill. Come! Kill me if you dare! Cheese ended there apparently. Ah, that, I needed that. Oh, sorry, Gary. Didn't mean to cut you off there, bud. That felt nice. I needed that. Ah. All right, how do my kills I get that time? That felt a little bit better. I just I wasn't babysitting them though. So, yeah, look at it. Like I don't know why I'm trying like this stupid underman thing. Just, just go there. Call it a day. Twenty more kills. Let's go. Block this one at least. Whew. Did you notice the trench reference in the Malco song? The trench ref. <laughs> the trench reference. Set, telling Trench that he. We were wrong to think he could stand with me. Is that is that is that what we're thinking there? <laughs> totally yes. The slam. There you go. Yeah, I, I guess that's what they were referring to when they were running the script for uh, Fallen Order. Oh, all right. What else we got? Her. We got Rossi. Hope you enjoyed our karaoke party there. Uh, yeah. Let's just go ahead and do the mark thing. Okay. Let's take care of his base. Didn't mean to do that. All right. Let's go. Come on. Get him out. There we go. Oh my gosh. So much easier. All right. Let's go ahead, get you out of here. Dude, stop calling Malgus for the assist. <laughs> All right, over here. Come on. All right. Let's set this up. Set her up. Oh, there we go. See, it's so much easier. There we go. All right, let's make sure. Let's start. Let's start. The, let's activate said cheese here. There we go. Let's go for the kill. I don't know who got it, but I think we can activate the cheese cannon. All right, the cheese cannon has been activated. All right. Woo! You played Pal World yet? It seems up your alley, says Rossi. I'll tell you how much I played it. It's usually the, the tale of all the other games. I'm like, I'm going to play this. I buy the game. I play 10 minutes. I get distracted by some sort of obligation. And I don't get back to it. <laughs> I played it for a little bit. I get the general concept of it. I I haven't given enough time to like say if I like it or hate it. I just I I just I 
my mind just can't get over Pokemon with guns. I know it's not. I mean, that's the quickest. That's the elevator pitch for it. It just doesn't feel right. It's like just. I don't know. I know, I know my brother's absolutely loving it. I, I again, I haven't had a chance to do it. Just my. I haven't played enough to like just get over it. That's like you know hitting the 360 no scope and just murdering Pokemon. It's uh. It's a, it's it's just it's it's an interesting concept, dude. Power is so cool. Yeah, it's, it's a lot of hype. I, and I think I was uh, what was the? I think I saw somewhere the budget for the game is like five six million damage uh, dollars, which is that's that's like that's that's crazy. They're able to pull that off. It's one of the biggest games of all time. Uh, not of all time, but of recent memory. So um, yeah, I haven't really had a chance to really kind of stretch my legs and play it. But I just I can't get over the the hump. It just. It, it reminds me of a parody video where a Pokemon where it's like the Pokemon are just like outright getting murdered in battle. That, that, that's what it feels like. All right, we don't need to do this ugly feat anymore. Is the GAC over now? Oh, yeah, we were the GAC is way over. Oh, uh, why did Pathfinder take so long to die? Well, that's the whole part of the cheese. So if you don't know what's going on there, you definitely need to know. I made a video about it a couple weeks ago. Um, long story short, true. Anytime you're critically hitting his allies, he grants heal over time. So when you're critically hitting Scarefell Pathfinder, he's constantly getting buffs. And what happens when Scarefell Pathfinder dies when he has a buff? He revives. So we're, we're, you're taking advantage of that so we can try to get tons of Veers and Piet kills. All right, let's go take on another stupid thing we got going on here. We got to do Confuse. That's an easy one. Let me go put my data disc back on, the, the good ones. Actually, you know what? Let's just leave it like this because Amplify Agony, it just makes it go by a little too quickly. Yeah, uh, I want to get as many confusions as possible. So let's go ahead and get a little bit of CLS on the board. Where you at? Boop, 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 boop. All right, you, 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 and get in there. All right, let's keep it moving. Uh... Did I get Yotter? Remember, you talk about wanting turn turn tier three of BAM event into a transition. I have the raw footage. Freed in DMs. Holy cow, man. How do you remember that? Like, I, I took me a moment to remember that myself. That was... Goodness, that was... That's... it's. <laughs> that's been a minute. That's been a minute since I've... Uh, dude, the freaking... How do you remember that? That was like 20... Yeah, that, that's, that's been a minute. Uh, let, me, let me see. Oh, yeah, I see it. Okay. Yeah. I'll, oh, boy. I can't remember why I wanted it, but I'll figure something out with it. I'll do something. Wow. It's been a minute. Mando event was uh, 20... Is that 2020 or 2021, man? I don't know. Time just... No, it was, I think it was... Yeah, it was 2020, right? Because that was the last year Mobile Gamer played. I remember he was around when Mando and Grieve Karga came out. Wow. That's crazy. Uh, thank you for that, Yotter. I'll have to remember why I wanted it. And then we could probably use it for something. Cool transition of some effect. Give me a new song. I need a little bit more energy. There we go. Oh, yeah. That, Gary, right on the money, baby. Right on the money. Perfect. All right. Keep putting it on auto. Eh? Oh, what else we got? We have Rossi. I got you, buddy. We have MQT. 20 months. Had some Luminati's. Yum, 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 yum. And if you need something special from Luminati's, they're doing heart-shaped pizzas. Did you even get any confused out there? I don't even know if we got any confused. Probably should have looked it on manual or uh, auto basic there. They're doing heart-shaped pizzas. So you better know I'm going to cash it on that. And then we have uh, Rio, $2. The song is called Childhood Died by Slap Bang. I'm assuming I'm not going to list it on stream or else they'll just claim my whole life. Ch what was the song called? Childhood Died. That sounds sad. <laughs> Star Wars is dead. Lost soul childhood died official video. Hold on, let me is I might I, okay. I I'll have to list this off. I have no idea if I'm gonna get my whole life's gonna get claimed. Uh Oh, but thanks for putting it on my radar. Right? The, the, the interesting, <laughs> interesting title there. <laughs> yeah, I, this looks like something that should have more views. 82,000. I guess it was just released a couple weeks ago. Okay. Yeah, like it's, that seems like something that should get like a, a bajillion views on that. 
All right, definitely missed mine. Okay, well, don't worry. I'll, I'll, I, you sell my mind, Raxus. Don't worry. Don't worry. Actually, I would, if I was you, I would, I would worry a little bit because knowing me, I'm gonna still forget. All right. What else do we have here? Why don't people use Imp versus Shock? A Witch Shock versus Lord Vader anymore? I mean, people do. Uh, you gotta remember a few things. Number one, Datacrons. There could be a negative Datacron interaction for troopers that just doesn't work very well. That's something that might work in favor of Lord Vader and maybe some crazy stats. Uh, not to say people don't use it. Um, I just, uh, generally there's better stuff that you could use. You know, you have bounty hunters that people might have. Maybe you wanna use Imperial Troopers for something else out there. Yeah, uh, for me, I just uh, generally when Vader's got five bajillion defense and stuff, it's a little scary. But no, I've seen people do it all the time still. I've seen people do the like uh, Iden with Imperial Troopers. I know that's that's a thing. So I, just because I don't use it doesn't mean someone else isn't using it here. I'm going to make you feel better. All right, hold on. I don't wear Rax. I keep telling my brain Rax is prime. Rax is prime. Don't forget the Rax is prime. Rax is prime. Rax is prime. Uh, you know, I hate when Datadisc just like, I feel like I should take off my Datadisc so I pick it a little bit slower. All right, what do we got here? GAC Insight. Stand up, we done. Tonight. Yeah, it's still a thing. It's not like extinct. Yeah, just uh, better counters. Maybe you just don't have it. I don't know. There's a lot of variety of reasons for me. Now that I got bow, I feel like I don't know. I feel like I've been spoiled. Now it's like I don't know. Uh, it's like I don't. I don't know. Uh, the, the whole bow thing is just kind of a funny thing. But yeah, look, this is what I'm saying. If people like to use Iden. Iden, I would. I mean, you could probably use Shock. Let's see. Yeah, Iden just feels a little bit better. But again, some people still pull it off. Let's do no cleanups. Yeah, you know, you still got people doing it. But yeah, if I was going to do this, I would, I think, Veers with, uh, if you don't, if you don't need to use Iden, it feels a little bit better. Clans, he's a trooper, all that cool stuff in between. So yeah, it's still very much a thing, though. Yeah. Ah, all right. Here, let me go do that. Okay. Can I trust you on auto basic? Auto basic. All right, try it again. Seems like the cheapest counter. Yeah, it's, it's still, it's still, it's an all right counter. Just, um. Yeah, just again, it, context is important. Maybe there's a data crown, maybe something else. Maybe someone doesn't have it. Maybe someone's got Iden on defense or whatever the case might be. There's a variety of stuff going on there. All right, what else we got? Um, we have Get Your Own Tots Two Months. Great stream today. Just on like SOKR a few days ago. Congratulations! What GL should I go for next? LLTKE, baby! I don't know what your roster looks like, so it's, uh, it's, it's, it's it'd be bold of me. <laughs> it'd be bold of me to just make a guess but i'm gonna make a guess i would go for either i, I think the, the meta is now in galaxy is you really want to get into that jedi master luke leia java triangle oh man i only got 10 confuses here you know what uh why don't we do a different direction here because yeah i'm not getting nearly as many uh confusions as i would like to get why don't we just go down the resistance route here hopefully a wee bit more turn meter yeah let's or we can go hold up for a sec here we go maybe something like that might be a little bit better yeah you that's yeah, that's exactly what i'm thinking trevor just do a bunch of droids seal us kind of burns through the team a little too quickly all right there we go um Yes, I would just say, I'm not sure what the roster looks like, but the, the, the quicker you get into, you know, Master Luke, Leia, Jabba, the better. They're just, they share so many core requirements and they're all more or less very good characters inside of that. So I would say, you know, go into it. I would say look into your roster. Maybe you're closer to Jabba. Maybe you're closer to Jedi Master Luke Skywalker. Just kind of examine it on a case-by-case -case basis. Yeah. You said my name, Mom. Let's go! And then here's Rex. See, I didn't miss you, Rex. Prime. You were next on the list. Next on the list. Right there, get your own tots. Uh, great stream today. Oh, I was the wrong one. Do you think Darth Vader should be reworked into a GL? So I, I've thrown around this idea. All right, this isn't working nearly as well as I was hoping. I'm just getting absolutely rolled right now. Holy crap, man. All right, maybe we do Jedi Training Ray. Let's do Jedi Training Ray instead of Shorty, because this is not going anywhere. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're not going anywhere. All right, all right. We'll do something else here. 
Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So I, I, I've thrown around this concept of maybe like doing an evolution process. I'm going to tell you straight up. I would be beyond surprised if CG just said, oh, by the way, you're Darth Vader. For, yeah, he's now officially a galactic legend. They're they're going to do something. If they were ever going to go down like this evolution route where they take normal characters and elevate them to a galactic legend, they would want to milk the money somehow. So I, I would expect that, that kind of generosity from CG's part. I mean, he was at one point a GL feeling character before the Great Nerf of 2021. He was banger. He felt better than some galactic legends. Like, it just felt so dang good. He was beating some Premier Conrad. Sith, he was beating at the time pretty much every galactic legend with some variant one way or another. And they took it away from us. They took it away. It was too good of a rework. So that was the closest we really got to a, a Darth Vader uh, galactic legend. So I. I'm not expecting like another Darth Vader anytime soon. I mean, I, I don't want to be the, it's not even news. It's just, I, I would be surprised if they did something like that. Yeah. This seems a little better. Did I even get any confusions? I'll check in a second. I think Jedi training would have been a lot better. We would have at least had maybe some mild turn meter train. This we're just sitting here. Yeah. All right. Uh, what else we got here? Thank you, Raxus, for your patience. Oh, uh, Rossi, I got Rossi with Mischievous Grievous. I got you. Oh, no, I didn't. Geo's got more of a backstory than Ray. Like, I I have more questions about Geo than I have about Ray. I, you know, I know we're joking, man, but Geo's probably got some of the most in-depth storytelling of all time. It's, it's an enigma wrapped in a mystery, or is it a mystery wrapped in an enigma? One of the ways. I want to know more about him. What if, what if Geo is the future of the Jedi Order? I, I'm just saying, I'm putting the ideas out there. What if Rey is going to team up with Geo, Grogu, Omega? I'm telling you, that's going to be like 18 tier stuff right there. Uh, Tango, 42 months, just crossed 9 million of six yells and through all three meta fleets. Guys! Someone's kicking some serious butt, it sounds like. Holy crap, can you guys just die? Oh my God. The one time I do, oh, whatever, let, let her do her thing. Geode as a Skywalker. Geode should start the next Skywalker saga. That's what I want to see. I want to see the rise, the fall of Geode, the lineage. I want to see. Uh, listen, don't hold back for me, Star Wars. That's what I want to see. Uh, what else we got here? We have that. I got Tango. I got Tango. Piotrek! Day 6-6 six, six of waiting for Cup insta-kill Datacron. Listen, Cup got a mild back during the... Yeah, I got freaking four confused. Why? For some reason, like I had no problem last time to do this. I think it's just my data discs. When I put Ample Agony, you just, they die in like two seconds. And it's like, that's not very helpful for me. So now, I don't know. For some reason, like the Piet thing feels a little bit more annoying. Just go around. Eh, whatever. All right, let's go Resistance. Yeah, we got to get a JTR. And then, you know what I'm going to do? Hold on. Let me, let me rework my data disc because these are not ideal. Here, let's get in here. All right, let's see. All right, so let's take, uh, take that off. Take that off. Take that off. Okay, let's get my ability exhaust on. Mm, okay, we'll do that. No, we don't want to do that because that's going to kill him off too fast. Actually, give me unstable decelerator back. You know, the unstable decelerator. Maybe get, yeah, you know what? Throw the C3 pin there and then get me. No, I want the ability. Yeah, give me. Where, which one's the. Oh, gosh. Which one's ability exhaust? I hate that they. There it is. Okay. Yeah, we'll go something like that. All right. Yeah, if we can get ability blocks on, that'd be great. Ah. Uh... All right, what do we got here? Where did I leave off, baby? Where did I leave off? Where did I leave off? Yo, Trek! Coming to get the 2999 so what the? Imagine, oh crap. Ah! <sighs> I'm about to put Jedi training right, whatever, just. Uh, let it do its thing, it's fine. They'll, they'll figure it out, they'll figure it out. Imagine that we'll all be 90 years old and Galaxy Heroes will still be around with like 20 GLs. Only 20 GLs by the time I'm 90. I feel like I would hope there's like a, a bajillion by then. 20 GLs. That means there's only what? 12 more GLs between now and 60 plus years from now. Oh man. Maybe even esports. So let me tell you, there is an opportunity for Galactors to be esportsy. The problem is, it just, it, it, uh, I don't wanna, I don't wanna talk about it sometimes. It just, it frustrates me. I, I'd like to forget about it. I really think CG mishandles the full potential of what this game could really be. 
they could do so much with this game and you know we, they've, they've done it but it's like it just i always get the vibe like they just don't care they don't want kid interaction they're, they're just in to make their buck and they're clocking out for the day they're just this the star is such an amazing community the galaxy is pretty so amazing i mean like i really wish they did more even again they don't even need to invite me you know i know whatever but that doesn't mean they should deprive the opportunity from the community to do more of those like community versus dev grand arenas i've i've even offered to like hey if you guys can just get us test accounts i will manage host pay for whatever to do to set up tournaments for the community you know just like you know another like content creator community showdown like get some of the best people in the community the audience set up monthly tournaments or you know semi-annual tournaments and unfortunately no, no one no one's taking me up on that offer but i said i'll literally do all the work i will set it up i will do the community managing aspect of it whatever it is all i need though is i need a way to set people up to do the tournament so i need like a test account for just people to have temporarily like they did for the the tournament that they did a couple years ago anyways i i wish there was an esports again they have the opportunity to set it up it's just i just don't think they care i think they're just in to get their money and that's it you said that cg yeah I, last year around the time when i uh we had the first draft of remember the sandbox tool we had or the drafting tool where we would just draft random characters and i was like oh this could be a fun like community event and i i told him it's like hey you know uh i have this cool tool it's like it's just version one i think it'd be awesome if we do like a community event and i even told him straight up i will take care of like setting it up talking to the people but i literally it's so annoying because i will set this up i just physically can't set up a tournament for grand arena there's no way in game i would need a temporary test account for people to use but um i, I just i don't think they they care you know uh, not the, not the person i talk to but i don't i just don't think capital games is a studio cares they like they, again they i mean look at the way they're treating their lord of the rings game if you've if you've been keeping an eye on that whole oh boy talk talk about rough time that community's having uh i mean here i'll give you a quick sum of it so there's been no communication from capital games for that game since like second week of december and you know whatever and, you know we, we we're, we're familiar that cg likes to take time off but there's been like no communication of any major extent that i'm aware of and it's been like a month and a half they there's like no more packs in the store which is like cg 101 always have packs that you can like physical packs you can buy in the game i guess there's no packs and the craziest thing is they don't even have a calendar for february like that's like low effort stuff like have a calendar for february i guess they don't have a calendar unless something changed today that is nuts uh, so I, I i really feel like heroes middle earth really shows you know it just it's very obvious that community is not a pillar for capital games and it's a, it's so unfortunate and again i've literally offered next to free help to do it but again i need a tool so i can set people up the the do private tournaments and that's that's just literally out of my control and i mean i, I could think of a way but i they probably wouldn't like the way that we would do it <laughs> so there is a way but uh, you know you know uh they, they probably just wouldn't like that uh that that direction but uh yeah but the the, the for you people playing heroes of middle earth i hope it gets better for you guys man i feel it's like i never I, I never root for like a game to fail because how would i i would, I would feel bad if people are rooting for galaxy of heroes to fail we're having a good time or yeah it's got its problems whatever i just feel like they really dropped the ball oh, crap i forgot to put jedi training ray in eh, whatever uh i i i hope the i hope they don't shut down heroes of middle earth i i, I feel bad I, I, I mean there's no excuse they definitely they ruined every opportunity they had to make the game decent uh so th there's no excuse for that i mean you i guess you you reap what you sow in that regard i just hope they they turn it around because man i oh it's you think a shutdown's incoming um i i was looking at numbers actually just uh today uh the february free calendar's up on the website but is there a like in-game calendar like the you know like how we have the normal in-game calendar and then there's the web store calendar from what i'm understanding there's no like in-game calendar for february um anyways i don't want to turn this into a massive lord of the rings here in the middle earth but anyways i'm rooting for you guys hopefully it gets better and at least cg responds and does something to you know even if it's minimal but right now they're not even doing minimal which is the crazy thing like <laughs> 
We're not asking for like crazy stuff. Uh, let's see. Yeah, electronic arts. Yeah, oof, this is rough. This is rough. I don't know. If this, so this is for January. Okay, so this is pretty fresh off the press. Oof. Eesh. And I get, you know, January could be a slower month. I mean, they take they take a lot of time off, it feels like. But here's what... Uh, here, check this out. Oof. Uh, so let's see. We're... Look how low it's... It's, it's 17th, and this is what? Apple Store. So this is iOS. I mean, it's it's fallen. Uh, I'm blocking the screen. Hold up. Oh, gosh, Gary. Move me away. I can't see the screen. Up there. Thank you. So... Lord of the Rings, Heroes Middle Earth, 7K downloads, which is not great. 100,000 revenue. And I get they have a web store, but I'm not imagining they're making that much more on the web store. I mean, dude, Plants vs. Zombies Heroes is doing you know better from a download perspective. That's not great. Uh, and then check this out. Android. Oof. $80,000. That's... Again, I don't know what their studio size is. Maybe they have a lot of outsourced work. Maybe they can keep costs. I don't know how much the license costs, but when you consider Apple's got to get a cut, Google's got to get a cut, the license got to get a cut, EA gets their cut, the employees get their cut, bills get their cut. 180000 for the entire month of January is... That's like... So many indie games do better than that. It's, uh, yeah, so... I don't know. I hope I hope for the best. Again, I it's just disappointing that they dropped the ball in the Lord of the Rings game, especially when you see all the similar competition for these type of games. You know, Raid, Watch of the Realm, Dragoneer, Arthur Legends Rise, and the many other related games like oof. Yeah. It's crazy. Uh alright, uh, Noodles, Warprint, Arnold, T one of my comeuppance and also comes out first. Nice. All right, so maybe maybe there's some interaction there. Because uh, again, when, when we were using our uh, an offense, the auto would never bring it out first. But again, sometimes the defense operates different than the auto offense. So yeah, I, I'm gonna check that out. I'm gonna, it's, it's good to know. Yeah, if it, if it always comes out first, that is a huge deal. It's a massive deal. Uh, February bonus calendar with B2 is up on the store. Yeah, yeah. See, so you know, Galaxers, we had one new thing this month. It's been a slow month, which is fine. You know, January it's historically slow. I feel like this January is definitely slower than some previous ones. But again. It's not like Heroes Middle Earth where there's like no sign of new content, new characters, no communication, not even the in-game calendar or packs. Like they're literal bloodline selling packs. They just ran out. They have like no packs in the store. That's that's absolutely crazy. They put on a crap game to get crap revenue. And I think that the thing that really annoys me, it just, uh, you know, the, the limited time I had from CG, my 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 experience has been like, oh, you guys don't know better. We here at Capital Games knows what's best for you guys. And I remember all this feedback that you know I gave, others gave, even people outside like of the the mobile gaming genre they gave. CG's like, oh, they're just they're just uh, was a hate baiting, whatever it's called, or uh, rage baiting. Uh, are the games great and it's like well the metrics aren't really showing that so the, the game looked bad I just, and I loved how they held their grounds like oh yeah the art style is great this is an intentional design choice like oh you guys should do something different and then people like to bring up the thing oh Galaxy of Heroes back in 2015 2015 a lot of years ago in gaming especially the mobile gaming world it's not a quite a fair comparison to compare Galaxy was a game that was developed probably Started development, what, 2012, 2013, the latest? You know, uh, it's not quite the fairest comparison to, <laughs> to make in that regard. And uh, even so, Galaxers has never had this type of, these type of issues revenue-wise. Uh, I think it maybe just goes to show, we take a lot here in Galaxers because it's a Star Wars, right? Even when the game's bad, it's Star Wars, it's, that's why we're here. I don't think most of us would be here if there was no Star Wars attached to it. But it goes to show, I don't know if Lord of the Rings Heroes of Middle Earth is as big, as forgiving as a community as a Star Wars folks are. Um, yeah, I, I don't think people are willing to be as lenient with uh, Heroes of Middle Earth. Whereas in Galaxies, we are so lenient to the point where CG knows it and they take full advantage of our leniency. There we go. This feels a lot better. There we go. All right. Anyways, what was I at? 
Anyways, best of luck for Hills Middle Earth people. I'm rooting for you. Hopefully, all gets better for you guys in the near future. You get at least some communication. Heck, at least get your at least get your login calendar. That's all I'm asking for for you guys. Uh, what else we got here? We have uh, they got Piotrek. We have Rossi. My guy. There we go. That was much easier. You should go do Bad Batch watch parties. Again, I, I, I would need to think of a way to do it creatively. I just, I, I could be wrong. Maybe people want to watch me stare at a screen in silence and go, huh? That was awesome. I could be wrong. Maybe people would like to see me. I would, I, if I'm going to do a watch party, I want to make it a little bit more interesting. Um, but I, I'll consider. I think the other thing is, I like watching you at the Lady of Analdoran together. So we usually like, watch the Star Wars stuff when it comes out. And plus, the other thing is, it's like late at night, man. Man, my, my, my evening schedules are, oh, shoot. Crap, I gotta get out here and like, hold on one second, hold on. All right, I got like 20 minutes here. Oh, I almost lost track of time. I actually have a thing here in a couple minutes. I think it's the biggest thing. I usually have the evenings, uh, got a bunch of stuff I usually have scheduled on a daily basis with meetings and all that fun stuff. Uh, we have uh, Rossi again, the Malico's karaoke made my car ride worth it. Heck yeah, hopefully, did you make it to your destination? I know you said you needed four hours. I, I'm almost giving you four hours. I got, I got I got 20 some more minutes. Oh, what am I doing here? Ass. Yeah, I'm not paying attention to this conquest right now. Yeah, you would. I'll, I'll, I'll think about it. I just, I've never watched the watch party, but maybe people. I, it's like, do people just watch you stare at the screen for like an hour, or do they watch you? I'm hoping they're watching it with you. Otherwise, I don't know. It'd be kind of weird if. I, I feel like I need to be. And plays when I'm watching a show, I'm like fully invested. I'm like I'm watching very carefully. I'm. I'm usually pretty silent. So I'm absorbing all the material. So, I, yeah, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I know people, you're not, that's not the first time someone's asked me about it. Um, I'll see if we can do something special. And then we have Yotter, five hours. Thoughts on the theory that relic abilities were scrapped in the data crons for more money? I, I don't think that's that far a stretch of, it, uh, of uh, a theory. Also, what are the songs you recommend for my friend at the gym? Ooh. What's one that people say they love bopping at the gym? Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Someone was saying, dude, this is like the best workout song. This is the mall song? I think it's the mall song because it's like, it's like, it's good for cardio. It really keeps you like, oh, 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 oh. try the mall song. Maybe the mall song will give them the uh, elevated uh, BPM to get a better uh, cardio exercise out. But yeah, I, the, I wouldn't be surprised if they scrapped data, uh, Relic Release for Data Crown. More money, easier the balance because they don't need the balance <laughs> i think that's what they like about datacron if it's broken it's broken i am surprised though i saw that they're gonna looks like fix the chirrut datacron they usually just if it's broken it's broken but i have a feeling maybe they just don't want chirrut knocking down galactic legends that's probably what my guess is so it's it's working against their favor uh, is what i'm imagining and then you have backs alexander uh with the 23 months you're the nest uh-huh hands down it's still too soon to make nest jokes at me and then we have one, one more. We have Reginald Brown, the five dollars. Imagine a hollow table at the convention. All characters unlock five minutes set defense, 30 minutes to full clear speed and banners wins. Again, that's not a far-fetched idea. I, I, these are things that are so possible to do. I I know so many games, whether it's mobile, triple A games, where they have booths at conventions and they have like people set up to play, or they actually set up an actual like dedicated esport thing where they invite the best players in the community to gather. Uh, I mean, even to the point where you can even set up, I, gosh, there were a couple games out there I remember watching where they would come to the convention and they would set up like a big PVE boss, like not even like a PVP thing, like Grand Arena, you know, player versus player real time thing, but like they would have like a big boss and then the player would try to try to beat the boss as fast as possible. It's like, uh, yeah, again, there's so many opportunities for just community engagement. And I, I just got a feeling like they just see you. They just... They don't, again, this is the way I look at it. I could be wrong. Maybe they absolutely love and adore their community, but they just don't give that Im impression that they want to engage. They want to be with us. It's just, you know, here's the post. All right, goodbye. You know, I, I'll, I'll Meathead, I mean, he, I feel like, I feel like they put Meathead on the leash. That's our community manager right now. I think, yeah, because I see him in Discord. You know, he wants to like chat with people, but I'm sure he probably has bigger plans. He would love to execute. Just at, at the end of the day, it's not his call. That's, I think that sucks. You know, I think we, we have community managers that want to do a lot, but they're, Oof. I don't want to. I don't want to get it. I, I, I hear. I hear things. I hear things. Uh, let's just say. You know, there's 
possibly a reason may maybe maybe not that galaxy is, is kind of gone through a lot of community managers you know you know again it's a, there may be maybe not a reason just saying i uh let's just say i'll i'll say this if i was to work at capital games it would take a lot of money for me to want to do that because I, I don't know if I, I i don't know if i want to work for capital games <laughs> um gosh i yeah i don't know if i'd want to. <laughs> gary what are we thinking at least 10 million dollars i would need to probably have like 90 percent of the revenue the, 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 the work for them i would the one role i would not want to do at sp capital games specifically not to say i wouldn't want to just at other places i've had offers to do this at other places I'm like eh, not at the moment but i appreciate the offer i would not want to be the community manager for galaxy series i just i the things i hear and you know you hear things it feels like the community manager is probably one of the least appreciated members internally at capital again just what i hear what i feel not saying it's a fact please don't sue me um <laughs> just my opinion everything here is just an opinion it's not factual I would just say for me personally, I would not want to be a community manager for capital games. That's that's uh, that's the, the the short and sweet of it. Um, that's what I feel like. Why do you call her Shorty? Because she's a shorty. Because her name is Sorty. Doesn't sound as fun as Shorty. I don't know. Shorty. Shorty in the club. Bottles full of bub. I can't remember how the whole song goes. I made a whole Shorty song at one point. Uh, yeah. I feel like you have to you have to fall in the sort. Yeah. Again. I would love, like I've, I've been presented offers to do like community manager stuff at other games. Like, oh, that, that would be a cool opportunity. Maybe, maybe at a different point in time. Um, like I would, I love hanging out with the community. I love engaging with people. I love, especially people that are passionate about the franchise or the game. But I don't want to work for a company that feels like they put you on a leash. You fall on the sword when something goes wrong and you just, you can't achieve that full vision of embracing the community. So uh, maybe there's other games I wouldn't want to do it either on, but uh it's a, it's unfortunate galaxy has so much potential it really does and it just i, I feel like there's someone over there just doesn't want to fully embrace the community and here's the character whale we'll be back in another couple weeks for the next character yeah don't shoot the messenger exactly 49ers or cheese can i just say oh my gosh i'm mad the lions lost how did the, they, the, they were doing so hot and i and i left what was, I was like you know I, I had to leave around third quarter and then they lost. It's like, oh my gosh, how do you how do you lose? It was a 17, 20 point lead going into the second half. And oh, I really want the Lions to win just because they kind of, you know, it's been a while since the Lions had a little bit of love and attention. So I'm a, a bit saddened uh, by the outcome of that. But hey, I mean, San Francisco, they, they were no underdogs going into it. So it was, you know, it wasn't too crazy to see San Francisco take it to the finish, like a colossal choke. Um. I, I, you know, I, I, I want to go. I'm going. I'm going San Francisco. That's what I. That's who I want to win. But don't tell Levin Alderon because she's all of a sudden very invested in football. I wonder why she cares so much. Something about this Kelsey guy. I, oh, she's got like a T-shirt that she's getting for the Super Bowl that says "I'm rooting for Taylor's boyfriend." So just make sure you, you don't uh, don't tell her that I said I'm rooting for San Francisco. <laughs> we salute you, Meathead. Is Meathead in the chat? You see here. We salute you, Meathead and Crumb. Hope the kid is doing well. Oh, yeah, man. I haven't heard from Crumb in a minute. I feel like, isn't Crumb the community manager for Heroes of Middle Earth? Yeah, I don't know if he's been involved with uh, Galaxy of Heroes stuff in a minute. Could be wrong. Yeah, anyways, I, I'm sure Meathead has, like, he, he, I'm sure Meathead would love to do more community engagement stuff. Yeah. I don't think it, no, I don't, I don't even think it's a Disney thing. I think it's it's strictly a capital games thing. I know it's not an EA thing. I'm, I, I can almost promise you, I know it's not EA for the reason why we have this communication disconnect between community and developers, because I have extensive connections and conversations with other EA folks at, for other games, and they have communications. Like you can see, they're more engaged with their audiences, their community managers are. Um, I, I think it's solely, an, it's a CG thing. And again, from my time being out there and people that know about capital games, people are like, oh, you know they seem like the black sheep of the industry like they're they're kind of the oddballs what i like they're stuck in a different era of gaming like they're still stuck in like the 2005 2000 era of gaming uh it's a much different world nowadays so i i don't think it's an ea thing i don't think it's a disney thing i don't think it's a lucasfilm thing i think it's just solely a, a capital games thing. just from my interaction playing other games seeing their community engagement seeing uh you know just seeing other games and just my experience in interacting with these other studios it's it's uh yeah I, I don't think it's like that for other people anyways uh 
Char Charles Davis, 199. Nice stream, bro. I was crying over the Texans. Listen, at least you're not a Bears fan. It's all I can say. It's it's part of our it's part of our ego now. We we're always like, oh, our our team sucks. Our team sucks. But don't worry. One of these days, hopefully before I die, we'll get another uh Super Bowl opportunity. If CG Cutie managers engage about once a month, WTF else they do for 40 hours a week? I I don't know. I mean, I'm sure they're, I'm sure like Meathead's like, he gathers people's opinions and like, oh, here's what people say about X, Y, and Z. I'm sure he's doing that. Um, I don't know. I mean, I know things, but I, you know, it's just probably, you know, I know things, but I, I, I know nothing. I'm taking the Jon Snow. I know nothing, Jon Snow. Anyways, can you guys give yourself a round of applause? Man, absolute blast. 10 out of 10 party that we had today. I'm hoping for another fun opportunity with you guys. And I want to thank you guys for the opportunities that you presented me today. Oh my, oh my, you guys put the light and spark in the Kyber Club magic. I think this is a great way of starting off the 3v3 Grand Arena season. It's a great way of getting back into the Grand Arena hype. And it's a great way of hanging out with you guys. Big thank you as always for those coming out, even for it's a second, a 25-8 attendance perhaps. Big thank you. To the Copper Club High Rollers, we're going above and beyond the Imperial Call of Duty with the Super Chats and a lot of gifted memberships today with Alex Otello, top of the charts of a 69 69. <laughs> Listen, people, here's the thing I want to remind you guys something. If Siege doesn't want to do it, don't worry. Because one thing that's awesome about Galaxers is we as the community. We don't need them to start the party. We know how to keep this party going. 25-8 for one extra hour. One extra day of partying harsh. If there's one of us, then there's two of us. And if there's two of us, then there's three of us. And when there's three, you know there's gonna be a fourth. And then there'll be a fifth. And then a six. Oh no. And once number six comes into the party, you know there's gonna be a number seven. And after number seven, things start getting really heated. And then eight comes up. Oh my. And then you know eight, they're bringing the snacks. And then the other guy's like, hold on, number nine's coming. He's got the main entree. And then 10 comes around. Did we miss out on nine? I'm losing track. And number 10 comes and he starts blasting the music. And oh my. Once that music gets stomping, you know number 11 is going to show up to the party. And number 11's like, check out my moves. He busts the move, and then hold on, number 12 comes. He's like, I'm going to bust the rhyme. Number 13 finally comes to the party. What are we even talking about, Gary? I don't know. I think what I'm trying to say is I love you guys. You guys are the best. You guys are the best community ever. And I'm absolutely privileged that I can be a part of it with you guys. And then Rossi... On the way up, five gifted memberships. Thank you. Did they get it in Polish? Okay, hold on, let's, let's do a speed version. Hold on, Gary. Speed version.
Goodbye.